Hello? Hello, gamers? Hello, 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 scene, hello, please, scene, scene, there we go. Hello, hello gamers, how you guys doing? Eight, eight, eight S has a minion instead of a mount. Is it worth doing? Is the minion hella cute? Is it very worth or no? Am I muted? Oh, you fucking, I fell for it. <laughs> I fell for it. I actually fell for it. You done tricked me. The minion is the brute justice one. Oh, oh the one that's like the little mech. Hi. Oldest trick in the book. Damn it, dude. <laughs> One of these days I won't fall for it. One of these days I'll be okay. Also, guys, look at my sage. Bro, he's so cute. Cute justice. I kinda nah, I don't want it that badly. I can always go back for that at my like at my own pace with like a small group. I don't need to like pull all y'all in to get cute justice. Cute justice is from the blue vendor as well. Exactly. So if there's another way to get it, then then frick it. Then uh we'll go for the if we do any savage mount farming today, we'll just do 12s. If you want to have a list, all the mounts. Oh, the extreme ones? That's a good idea. That's a good idea, Valk. Wouldn't be super hard anyway. Yeah. You might be able to solo at 80 to 90. Exactly. <laughs> we need to see all the emotional damage. <laughs> I can't believe the raid storylines. The raid, the unvoiced raid storylines are like pulling me through the trenches as badly as they are. I see you finished off your stage living. Yes. So one thing I was thinking today, um, because I, do, I don't know if I want to do any main MSQ today because we're close. We're like 77, 78 MSQ. So we're getting close to like the final stuff. And I'm, I have to be honest, I'm not emotionally ready for that today. <laughs> so we're going to save that for next week uh, alongside the coils raids that we're doing. Hi, it's Lua. Welcome back. And Non, thank you so much for the gifted. What the heck? Um... Level 20, baby, you're schmoovin'. Level 20 already? You're schmoovin'. He thinks he's close, how cute. Maybe you guys can have a little MSQ today as a, as a treat. Reminder that today's gonna be a bit of a shorter stream, uh, cause I have uh, real life, real life little din, din to go to around like seven. It would be better if I stop sooner. Might be a four hour stream, might go a bit longer than that, but it's gonna be shorter than normal for sure. There's like 24 MSQ till the end of, oh, okay. Maybe we'll do a little bit then. Maybe you guys can have a little MSQ as a treat. But I wanted to do, I really want to start the post Moogle quests, because I've heard good things about them. Uh, I was thinking we might do a little Are bit of the- ready for love? Hey, <laughs> Nan, thank you for the bits. I was thinking we'll do a little bit of the healer roll quests, because Sage is now 80. Um, and my Gunbreaker is 75, I think. So we can, we can like, I think if you're going to MSQ, you should do it first. You're not going to want to stop. Fuck. Okay. Well, in that case, we have to save it for next week. If I'm not going to be able to contain myself, we have to save it. Because next 14 stream after today. I mean, I wasn't even going to stream 14 today, but here we are. Time makes fools of us all. Um, but if that's the case, then I'd have to wait until Tuesday and it would be so painful. And then I wouldn't want to do coils. And I really want to do coils because I've been loving the raids. The raids have been so much fun. I don't think there's too much trauma in this branch, but a lot happens. Yeah, so maybe no MSQ. Maybe no MSQ because if it's a lot happening, I'm just going to die. Or just stream Final Fantasy tomorrow. Just stream all week, Final Fantasy. <laughs> Oops, all Final Fantasy. There's a lot of MSQ for you to tackle though, Tara. Okay, we'll survive. We will survive. Oh, I need to go home. I need to go back to home data center. Back to Maduin. But I definitely wanna, I was thinking, I, I can't decide. I can't decide if I wanted to do a little bit of post Moogle or a little bit of Hildy, Hildebrand. Cause both are supposed to be good subjectively or subjectively to some people they're good to some they're not. <laughs> Rando. Tara, I'm not emotionally ready for MSQ. Also, Tara, let's do roll quests. Oh, okay. Uh, so I did all my gunbreaker quests, right? None. I also have to work today, so in two to three hours, I will have to leave. That's okay, Non. We're only going to be doing like a four-ish, a little bit extra stream today, so you won't miss much. Um, Non, thank you for the biddies. Um, uh, I finished leveling, uh, or not finished leveling. I, um... Finish the Gunbreaker story quests. They were okay. I didn't mind them. They were okay. Um, and at the end of it, oh God, what was it called? Oh, I remember because I, I was in a call with uh, Vel and I was like, oh my God, Vel. It's telling me I can't take the next quest until I finish the role quest titled To Have Loved and Lost. So the tank one is already going to be immense emotional damage. Role quests are just as bad. <laughs> Do you have, have you done Paladin Questline? I have not. 
I have not. People were saying last was it last stream? People were saying that they're like the worst in the game. The Paladin quest lines. Roll quests hurt. Why? Why do all of them hurt? It's not fair. Let's see what I got Gunbreaker to. 75. Okay. He's got he got a little bit of ways to go. He got a little bit of ways to go, little buddy. Um, Reaper is okay. I need to catch up on Reaper as well. The problem is, I've been genuinely enjoying Monk. I've been genuinely enjoying Monk, even though the rotation is like weird and I'm not good at it. I almost feel like I want to focus Monk over Reaper, but that means more catching up to do in terms of levels. I don't know what to do. Reaper is fun. I'm not shitting on Reaper. I just like Monk because he's all punchy. He's just punchy little angry boy. He's great. Paladin questline is the worst. That is news to me. I actually enjoyed them somewhat. Really? You're on a new data center? Yes, I am. I'm on Mado and Dynamis. A Rum Reborn Paladin and uh, Stormblood Paladin are decent. So when does it become bad? Oh, the Heavensward Paladin quests are awful. Got you, got you, got you. I have 500 bits till the next badge? Nah, no. Nah, no. You're too supportive here. Um. Oh, first things first. Most important. Most important thing to do is go lose to the, uh, the mini cag pod. Also, did I get you guys to pick my numbers yet this week? For the, for the big cag pod? I don't think I did. So you guys are going to shout out random numbers for me again when we do that. I would like to announce that last week's drawings, you guys didn't win me anything. So um, you need to do better. You need to apply yourselves. They don't pull till tomorrow. Yeah, so I got to do it. I got to do it. Do, 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 do. Come on, big money. Aw, well, there's no way I can get a six now with this lineup. Mm. Let's go for this line. Ugh. Garbage. Do, do people actually put thought into any of these or do you just click randomly? Do you just like slap it out? Oh, oh, hang on. There could be a one right here. <gasps> oh, Poggers. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> I have the 500, so I just need to distribute them. You need to use them uh, uh, strategically, non strategically. Gladiator quests and Stormblood Paladin quests are decent, in my opinion. Got you. GG. Easy, easy clap. Here we go. Here's some more. Oh, oh, there's our one. Oh. Oh, no way. Wait, twice in a row? Bro, it's my lucky day. Oh, I'm feeling lucky. I'm feeling lucky, boy. Double 10,000? Are you joking? All right, I'm feeling lucky. Let's go buy the big... <laughs> okay, you're hacking. <laughs> Let's go buy the big tickets. I'm feeling real lucky. I'm feeling real lucky. Oh, shit. No, hang on. There's an event square happening. There's an event square. Hello? Event? Which one is this? <gasps> Yo, Jimbo! Let's go. I did two 10k and a 3600 one day. Is it even possible to get three 10ks? Hello, other human. I wish you luck. But also, I wish you not luck. Everyone, Technically, everyone can win this event, right? There's not one single winner. <laughs> Considering your excitement for Yojimbo just now, probably do Hildy. Okay, okay, okay. We'll we'll dip our toes into both if we have the time. We'll do a little Hildy. We'll do a little post Moogle. Because do you know what I really want? Do you know what I really fucking want? I want little tiny like police officer glam for my Lala, like really badly. I want post Moogle cap, and then I want like blue uniform. Hildy's great. You need to do it. We'll we'll we'll, we'll dip our toes in. We'll see how it is. Sarah, have you done Kugane Castle? <gasps> Stormblood optional. No, I haven't. Let's do that. Where is it? It's coming. Nice cock. <laughs> but only if you give me the formula. <laughs> non, thank you for the bits. I appreciate you so much. There's your stream idea. Do Hildy today. Let's do some Hildy. 
I kind of love this game because nothing feels like a waste of time and everything feels fun. It, the, the, the biggest problem is just picking one thing to do when I want to do all the things. I wanted to work on a little bit of home decor today, but I don't know if we'll get there. Yo! Yo! I've only won at this once. Every other time I get knocked out hella early. Oh, please no. I love the music in this, as well. <gasps> Ooh, I almost walked into it! Quick important question, in a few minutes for the first time, I'm going to commentate uh, some Pokken matches. Do you have any tips and advice for you to commentate? I've never commentated anything. Uh, just do your best. Deep breaths. Everyone's there to have fun. That's about all I can say. Oh, they're going for it! You greedy! Oh, I was going to go for it. I'm glad I didn't. But yeah, Hildy's great for a laugh, and you're totally right. There's no pressure to do something or not do something. Totally. We're fine here. Foolish bamboo, you dare face my blade. Uh, am I okay here? Yeah, I am. Maybe I just follow this Raya person? Because if they go out, I go out with them. <laughs> I'm alone. All right, you always choose the coin pile. You always just sit here and you let the fates decide. That's what I do anyways. It won me one time. Good luck, princess! Have fun! That's the most important thing. Please! Choose the gold pile. Always choose the gold pile. It works 100% of the time, 50% of the time. <laughs> oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. <sighs> oh, 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 oh! <laughs> I panicked. I was actually safe where I was. I panicked. I don't know how, but I'm usually able to guess right on this. Literally, my entire strategy is just sit on the gold pile and pray. It's one in three chances, right? And there's no he heckin' way you're gonna follow the, the correct pile. Oh, let's go do our cackpots. Uh, where's the big one again? It's up above me, right? Did I do the mini games? I think I did my mini games. Oh yeah, I did. Choco races? I suck at choco races, but they're fun. There it is. Mm -hmm. Or was that Hushmal? I don't remember, but the part where it does the angle cut is also seen in an Alliance raid boss? No way. Which, which X-Pack is that for, Izagi? I haven't even touched the Hildy quest lines, no. All right, guys, pick my numbers. It's for Stormblood. Oh, shit. So here's what I want to try and get done today. I want to try and do... Um... It seemed that you didn't have the intelligence to defeat that. <laughs> Non, don't bully me. Eight. Um, shout out numbers, guys. I need four numbers. Um, I want to do... What was the dungeon that was recommended? I can't remember. It was an optional dungeon. I can't remember the name of it. Eight, three, two, 
Um, so I want to do that optional dungeon because that'll be quick. I want to do the Hildy one. Eight, three, two, one. That's going to be it. All right, there's one. Kugane Castle. Thank you. So I want to do Kugane Castle. I want to do the Hildy quest lines. Um, I would like to do a little bit of house decorating just to get like the framework done that I was thinking of. But that that's kind of at the bottom of my list in terms of what we'll do. Six, five. Uh, I'll pick one number here. Zero. Wow. Oh, risky. And a nine. And then we need one more. More numbers. Would you like me to tell you the location of the first Hildy questline? Actually, yeah. Just so I have it in my mind on where I need to go for it. I know where to start the, mo the post moogle. Four. Seven. Four. Oh, that's a one. That's not a seven. Uh oh. Seven. Four. <laughs> four. <laughs> Guys, I don't think the number... You know what? It's a random number. It has a chance to be anything. 4744. All right, fine. Fine. Wyman didn't Ulda. Okay. Uh, first, what sounds like the most fun first is doing the... Uh, 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 what do you call? What do you call? What do you call? Kugane. The Kugane Castle. So that'll be in Stormblood. Probably, I would imagine the quest would start in Kugane, right? not going to start in Kugane. You guys are going to be like, actually? Was the hot spring bit part of it or a separate thing? Wait, hot spring bit? Next to Ruby Bazaar? Um, bow, bow, bow. Ruby C. Oh my god, there's so many side quests in here. What's the name of it? <gasps> King of the Castle. That has to be it. That has to be it. Ruby Bazaar. I miss Kugane, dude. We weren't in here for very long. I miss Kugane already. Whoops, I went the wrong way. <gasps> Could do Rathlos Trial as well. That's not a bad idea. Sir Terabellum, oh thank heavens, I'm in dire need of a capable adventurer and I can think of none better. Local officials have been working desperately to keep this confidential, but there is trouble in Kugane Castle. It has been overrun by a band of outlaws. What's more, they've taken hostages, a number of nobles along with the Bugyo, Kugane's highest magistrate. They're demanding the country's borders be closed off, insisting Kugane's efforts to establish ties with other countries is folly. Why, if they had their way, I imagine foreigners, or Ijin, as they call them, would never set foot here ever again. <gasps> Stormblood optional trials! Wolves. Wolves. That's a good idea. Under normal circumstances, the Seki Segumi uh, would have taken steps to immediately resolve this crisis, but they dare not do anything to put the Bugyo at greater risk. To proceed would require a decree from the Bakufu, yet I fear there is no time to send an envoy to the royal capital and back. Nevertheless, they have done their due diligence and delivered a missive. While waiting for a response, they have also called upon the East Aldernard, Aldernard? Trading Company in an attempt to potentially expedite the rescue of the hostages. Hi, Catnip! Welcome in. Thank you for the hydrate. You want a full eight people, uh, or probably four plus uncapping for Athos. Okay. We'll be able to handle the lug. Or will you be crushed under the weight of all the bits? Crushed under the weight, for sure. For sure, non. <laughs> Thank you for the videos, by the way. As to why they would go out of their way to contact us, well, one of our captives is fr is from Ulda. It goes without saying the repercussions of a foreign dignitary coming to harm would be dire. Because of the Sekisegumi cannot yet act in an official capacity, they've asked for my assistance in assembling a small contingent to il infiltrate the castle. If you would join our cause, make for the aqueducts in the Rakuzu Rakuza district. There's a hidden passage leading into the castle kept under guard by the Sekisegumi. Tell them I sent you, and they will explain what you must do. Are the near raids from after Shadowbringers, by the way? Because that's another thing I'd like to do. Not, like right away but like at some point I would like to get a taste of near before I decide to play near and why not get it through the near raids nears post uh, shadow K okay. will you transfer data centers no way I can play with you I think jet you can data center hop I was on ether literally before I logged in 
because my friends are still on ether, so I just hop back when when we're queuing up for like roulettes and stuff. Have to finish 5.0. Okay. You do it from the login screen, Jet. You right-click your character and you say travel uh, data center. I can't remember what it's called, but it's under world travel. Yeah, it doesn't even take long unless the destination is congested. Every single time. So when I was buying stuff for uh, decorating my house, I was using uni universalis.app to see the cheapest prices. And I was just hopping everywhere. And it never took longer. What was the longest that I saw on one of the more congested worlds? A minute? And it didn't take longer than that for sure. How? You're on Ether right now. So log out, go to the like character screen, and then right click on your character's name. And it's like the second option from the bottom. Visit uh, data center or something like that. Hi now, welcome back. Yeah, you have to be logged out from your home world. Yeah, yeah. It's honestly so good. So like anyone on an NA data center can play with each other. <gasps> oh, there's a setting I wanna change. Sorry, I, d I didn't mean to jump scare anyone. I just remembered it. I saw a video about it this morning. Oh shoot, what is it under? I think it's under character config. There we go. I turned off store all newly obtained items in the armory chest because I would rather it go in my regular inventory. My armory chest, let's see how disastrous it is. Oh no. I gotta, I gotta, oh, it's bad. <laughs> It's real bad in there. Don't look. Don't look. Shame. Don't shame me. Listen. 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 How do I get down there? I just fucking jump? Where does it want me to go up? Hello? How do I get to this quest? I think I need to get down. How do I get down? Hi, Simi. Welcome back. How you doing? That armory chest disparage. Don't bully me, okay? I'm sensitive. No shame, I do the same, Tara? Good. I'm also just a hoarder, and I think that I want to keep everything for glam, but then I, I like, my toxic behavior is I say I want to keep it for glam, and then I don't even put it in my, like, armory chest. Or not the armory chest, the, um, dresser. I made it. Shame, it won't let me say it twice in a row due to anti-spam. <laughs> Terry, you jump? I went the long way, okay? Listen. Listen, I am cute little peasant boy. I actually really fucking love this. Genuinely, I think I'll keep this shirt that I got from Nabatha Rang. Oh yeah, when we did the Light Warden. I genuinely think I'm gonna keep this in my dresser and like save it for future clams because I just like like little peasant boy and it's so cute with my little satchel. He's precious. Hello! How you doing? Oh, I can't wave at you. <laughs> Running away. <laughs> Took the long way for a shortcut. Listen, listen here you. I'm not here for this sass today. Hello, Sekizigumi Blade. You were sent by the East Aldenaut Trading Company, and there is still a chance. Permit me to apprise you of the situation. The castle is presently held by a group of criminals under the leadership of a merchant named Kageyama. We believe his demands to close off our borders, as ludicrous as it seems, are a vain attempt to eliminate what he sees uh, as a threat from foreign businesses. If it were only him and his cohorts, I am quite confident my men and I could easily route them on our own. The problem, however, is his bodyguard. Our informants tell us he is a swordsman of great renown in the Hingen underworld. He demands exorbitant sums of money, defending his clients with seemingly inhuman displays of strength and skill, uh, commensurate with the price he's paid. Diad, welcome back, how you doing? Your character looks like a little worker going off to do a job exactly catnip, and I love it. It's so cute. This merchant needs a slow and painful death. Your task will be to contend with Kageyama and his hired blade in the heart of the castle. With all eyes focused on you, they will fail to notice my men's intrusion to rescue the hostages. It shames me to ask this of a civilian, but if we are to save those people, I can see no other way. Doing great, how about you? Doing so good, doing so good. Today's a bit of a shorter stream for those that are joining us a little bit later, uh, cause I have some IRL things, but we're gonna be going for at least, at least four hours today. 
Oh god! Not the watch mojo jump scare. <laughs> non, thank you for the biddies. Uh this is a group of four for this dungeon, right? You're coming. And you're coming. Do we have anyone else that wants to do Kugane Castle? Optional side dungeon? You'll see Kageyama more than once. Ugh. There. What role do I want to play? What level is the dungeon? Level 70? Maybe I'll do, um... Do I want to do Sage or do I want to do Reaper? Maybe I'll do Reaper. Because I feel bad that I'm, I'm enjoying Monk more than Reaper, so I feel like I should play Reaper a little more to see if it can weasel its way into my heart. Jolly, where'd you get that burb? Hello? Where you get that burb, though? Where you get that burb, though? Scarlet Peacock. Oh, you bought it. Oh my god. Okay, can anyone attest to the Spriggan outfit? I was, I was casually going through the Mog Station yesterday, and I'm planning out a bunch of things that I want to buy very, very soon. Has anyone bought the Spriggan outfit? Do we know how cute it looks on a Lollafell? Am I stupid for wanting it? <laughs> the Spriggan outfit, I like the little hooded like chess piece with the little Spriggan. Had it for a bit on Mina, didn't buy though, got you. Reaper gets super cool down at level 80, that makes its rotation super cool. Terry, you can... Dream fitting, dream fitting, dream fitting. I forgot about dream fitting. I forgot about dream fitting. Well, at some point we need to go dream fit it, so I can just, I can, <laughs> these are valid questions, Tara, valid, thank you. So in shroud, oh wait, yeah, it's probably in shroud. Offers your flesh as a vessel to your avatar, gaining maximum stacks of Lemure shroud. Certain actions cannot be executed while playing host to your avatar. Shroud gauge costs 50. Lemure shroud? What is Lemure Shroud? Is it this? I don't know. I trust your opinion on it. You didn't need to pay. Is there another way of getting it? It was probably an event, Valk. It was probably an event. Because I know a lot of stuff that was previous events uh, are listed on the Mog Station now that you could buy if you wanted. That a lot of people got for free. Oh, you know, it would probably be an Easter thing. Basically, it replaces your two skills with upgraded versions for short duration. Gives you five stacks to spam them. <gasps> that's like... It, that sounds like perfect balance for monks. Do I aspire Kagane Castle? Yes, you do, Bird. Yes, you do. We have room for one more if anyone wants to join us. I kind of have to go pee. Terry, you and your Reaper outfit is so cute. Thank you. I wanted some way to use the cape. And this hood matches it basically perfectly. I love my reefer glam. He's a cute. I love fully armored glams. I just wanna I just wanna appreciate those for a little bit. I love it. You gonna have faith to try for spooky horror stream? That's a good idea, hike! Today I wanted to do something a little different because it's just a shorter stream. We'll probably do a spooky stream next week. Looks cool, at least with good damage. Does it fully change you? Maybe I gotta get Reaper to 80 then. Just to give it the benefit of the doubt. <laughs> How's everyone but Terra doing today? <gasps> My heart, you wound me, Catman. You wound me. You should see your Paladin Glam, if I haven't. It's a new Glam you're trying? You can always post it in a uh, gameplay. Oh wait, is this you, Jet? Are you Sophie? No, I thought Sophie was someone else. Wait, is this you? Jet, are you Sophie? It's hard to keep all your character names in order in my brain. You are Sophie, got you. It's giving, like, it, I like it. It's, the helmet is giving um, Dark Souls, like the, the base armor. 
in a good way. In a good way. I really like it. I like it, I like it. Hello? Hello, cute cat boy? Oh, it's a Nizagi. Hello, come in here, you. Also, show me your weapon. What is happening there? What is happening with your weapon? Can you draw that? Ooh! <laughs> it's just a crystal on a stick. I love it. I love it. Izagi so cute. Izagi such cute cat boy. I can't. Uh, okay, we're gonna queue up in just one second. I just gotta do a quick little pee break because I've had a lot of coffee this morning. <laughs> it also comes from quest reward. Okay, bad. Cool. All right, be right back. Okay. Here we go, Julie. I got it. I got it. There it is. <laughs> I made this at work because I remembered this meme format and I was like, this is how Tara reads chat. Here's me. Here's the rest of Twitch chat. Here's Julie. And here's my poor fucking mods that I always miss. <laughs> uh, I, I like. I figured I should be self-aware. I should be self-aware of the way I read chat. Oh my god. You were thinking about me. Literally, Julie, I wanted you to take it that way. It, that was like my form of, of an apology <laughs> of how much I miss you guys' messages. When's it? Just do it. <laughs> wait, wait, did I just, did I turn this man into a hat? <laughs> what have I come back to? <laughs> what have, what is happening here? <laughs> <sighs> Gonna be doing the Shadowbringers raid soon. Oh! We're no stranger to love. You know the rules and so do I. A full commitment is what I'm thinking of. You wouldn't get this from any other guy. <laughs> Nan, thank you so much for the minis and the meme. Okay, let's do some Kugane Castle, shall we? Shall we, shall we? I gotta make sure my settings are, are like normal. I think they're normal. Oh. In we go. Wait. Yeah, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. I don't think it's unrestricted. If it's unrestricted, we're bailing out. I had it on for a little bit, but I don't know if it's on right now. I've done it. I've given you 5k bits. Non, thank you so much. Thank you for all the support. It means absolute world to me. You know that. Gane Castle. He's ugly. Your catboy's too cute. Stop being cute. Stop being cute in my presence. I like the big boots. The theme though, it's like the Stormblood theme, but different. I'm really digging it. I really love the number of ways that they basically remix their own themes. Reprisals, I guess you'd call them. Banger alert, dude. Leap motive. And Soken loves a leap motive. It's so good. I'm 
I'm so not used to playing Reaper at 70. Because I've mostly been doing uh, roulettes with it, so usually it's level 50, right? Feels pretty good. And gave in that. <laughs> non, you're too supportive. My heart. Oh, sounds like light motif. Thank you. Thank you for correcting my garbage pronunciation. Tara's gonna love the theme from Redacted. Dude, I feel like I'm gonna be like gasming all over Endwalker's music. Just for how much you guys have been like building it up. Oh, I screwed up that ability. like a proximity or it makes a massive AOE that little boy little bomb boy haven't been nice enough. You haven't been nice enough giving 5k bit. Excuse me? Do you know the meaning of the word? Oh, we should not put these in the middle. We should put them over here. Given 25 gift subs. Only? Only. You're a weird one. Mr. Grinch. I'm really enjoying this version of the of the Stormblood theme. I need orchestral roll. Saw in a, in a video of tips. How do you? <gasps> Control and the arrow keys changes the position of your camera. I, cu I couldn't remember if it was alt or control. So good. Gotta hop off. Good luck. Valkyrie's good seeing you. Oh, now it feels way too high up. I wanted to see more, but now it feels too high. <laughs>
Dojin Maru. Is Final Fantasy fun? I'm about to get it, I don't know much about RPG. Oh my god, you're in for a treat. You are in for a treat. It is very fun in Nexus. Very, very fun. This has absolutely become a hyper fixation for me. <gasps> the board's flipped? I'm dead. Help! Oh my god! I'm getting bullied. Yeah, l listen to Rando in Exus. Literally. If you're even slightly curious about it, you can experience so much of the game at, like, at no cost. There's so much story and so much content just in the free trial. Who wants to visit the Void Not? Are you looking to bully somebody? <laughs> Did you know that the critically acclaimed MMORP- Oh. Is that a bot? What, is that a regular mob? What does that do? Critically acclaimed MMORPG, Final Fantasy XIV has a free trial and includes a vera uh, the entirety of A Realm Reborn and the award-winning Heavensward expansion up to level 60 with no restriction on playtime. Sign up and enjoy enjoy Eorzea today. <laughs> so good. I love the copy. Oh, can I stun that bomb? Yes, I can. Oh, Sophine. Jat, you were so close to dying. Holy heck. so long since I've done this dungeon, I don't even remember most of it. It was just recommended. Somebody was like, have you done the Kugane Castle? I was like, nah. I am a young, impressionable gamer that will listen to the recommends of my audience. How much does this, does, does this game cost? Last I checked, it's actually on sale. Like, Endwalker is half off, because I bought it for, like, my good friend Vel, um, for $29.99 or something. So, the whole game, $29.99. I mean, there is the monthly fee you gotta worry about, but still, just like, value town right now for the amount of content that, that's in this game. Monthly fee? Exactly. 
It's all 50% off. Yeah. And then how much is the monthly fee right now? If you only want one character? You've done well to make it this far, but I'm afraid your journey ends here. Come, Yojimbo! We have visitors! Yo! Let's go, Yojimbo! Money per value in this game is insane. Even if you don't like story, there's so much. There's so much. My friends have been picking up crafting and loving it. And it's inspiring me to pick up crafting. Oop. The free trial is massive. There's that clip of me reacting to a certain thing that happens in Heaven's Word, and I'm like bawling my eyes out, and somebody in chat's like, free trial by the way. <laughs> Still on free trial by the way. <laughs> uh oh. Come, Daigoro, it's time to collect what is ours. Money! Money, 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 money. It's twelve ninety nine USD, I think. Okay, that makes sense. Yo, Jimbo was in ten, one of the strongest summons. Can't wait to play it. This is why you recommended the dungeon, cause Yo, Jimbo, you know me so well. You know me so well. And like, honestly, everything we've talked of so far to sell this game doesn't even touch on the fact that the community is just so good. So good. I haven't. I've not felt this welcomed in an MMO in like my entire gamer life. If you like Yojimbo, you'll do, you'll love Hildebrand. Okay, let's fucking go. Oh 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 oh. <laughs> Yo! Storm of love, storm from blood of our fallen brothers. Give me money. Give me money. There's a reason why this game wins best community award for two years in a row. The math adds up. The math adds up. Oh, I do. <laughs> I pressed the limit break button at that exact moment. I was like, what happened? What happened to my limit break? Your coffers appear empty, Kageyama. If you cannot pay my price, then I'm finished here. Dude. I'm capped on tomes, I know. I need to spend them. I've been like trying to hold on to them for whenever I get access to the level 80 poetics, but I don't think it's gonna come until after MSQ, like until 5.0 is done. Please have mercy. No. No, sir. No mercy for you, sir. I absolutely not. I found orchestral rules for sale in Roggers. Ooh. The melee DPS limit break does more damage than the ranged, and uh, the ranges is an AoE. Yes. I think I saw somewhere that it's better to use any of the ranged uh, limit breaks if there's 
more than one target, like if there's at least two targets, but otherwise you're better off using the melee limit break. It should come next stream if you do MSQ. Okay, in that case, we will do spending on an orchestral roll. <laughs> 80 poetics gear is post 5.0, that makes sense. In 10, you have to pay Yojimbo gill. More gill equals more damage. That's so cool. So he's the strongest, but you also have to have the monies. You gotta have the... Hello, cute cat boy. Hello, cute cat boy. You also have to have the monies in order to, to pay him for the damage. That's really cool. I love these pants! What, what pants are these? What is that? <laughs> augmented... Oh, no, no. It's not augmented. Wind silk bottoms is what it was. Unless this is now the wind silk bottoms. Also, also, another tip I saw in a video today. Did you guys know you could scale the window? Did you know you could do this? Like, let me see your adventure plate. Scale windows. Scale the windows. What cute boy you are. What cute boy. Let me give you pets. Yeah, I, I watched, I can't remember the name of the video uh, this morning. Whoops, I'm trying to type pet, help. Caps, it's case sensitive? Oh my God. There you go. You can scale, yeah, we figured that out because a lot of uh, viewers were having trouble reading it while I was reading it. So we scaled it up to, uh, I think it's 120. I think it's 120% right now. But I like the fact of it scaling adventure plates and like the character window we should scale up so we can see ourselves a little better. That's a little too big. That's a little too big. Uh, I don't know what I want this one. 120? 120 looks good. Bigger windows. Want a Rathalos? I want to do a little bit of Hildy first. Or, or do we want a Rathalos? What should we do? What should we do? What do, gamers? Hildy starts in Uldao from Wyomond, or Wyomond. First person to talk to you if you started there. Okay, I, yeah, I have not even touched Hildy yet. Whew. Do Hildy get a taste for it? I like that. Let's do that. You're my superstar. Excuse me, sir. Do you have a moment to talk about our Lord and Savior Hildebrand? I do. I do. Let's do Hildy. Let's do some Hildy. We'll wet, we'll wet our whistle. We'll wet our whistle with some Hildebrand. Also, I just looked up in chat and saw Catnip lose all their terabytes. Rest in pepperoni, Catnip. While you do Hildy, I'm going to try and start the Shadowbreaker Raids. Let's go. I can't wait to get to those. Now, the Shadowbreaker Raids, can I access them the minute we hit 5.0? Or do I have to wait until I'm done the post-patches? Either way, I'm happy, but... ill conceived Venture. The Way of the Samurai. Is it the Way of the Samurai? Rise and Fall of the Gentleman? What's the guy's name? Wyman? That sounds like... Ah, oh, Wyman. Okay, it's Rise and Fall of the Gentleman. Yep. <laughs> Um, let's do it on Monk, in case it gives experience, because my Monk's only 56. You now own 14? Non, yes! That means I'm doing my job right, if I'm convincing people to buy video game. Triple Triad! Hold up. Hold up. You say Triple Triad, I say bet. Three open. Swap. No, not swap, you fuck. It's gonna take my best card. I'm calling it right now. Hildebrand, Heliodor, Maximilian, Mandeville. Oh, he took my shittiest card. Thanks so much for the follow, by the way. Uh, I'll use the old clip there. Oh, get freaked. <gasps> How dare you take your own card? What is this hot steaming pile of actual doo-doo that I got swapped? This is the worst. Ah. <sighs> I'm just gonna put it here. Actual steaming pile of garbage card. Whatever, I still win. No, one more, one more. Give me your card. Give me your card so I can move on. You got a Cloud Strife card. We don't know where it came from. My favorite thing is like doing an alliance raid or something and then looking at my inventory and be like, ooh, I got a card. <laughs> I'm way too obsessed with Triple Triad, and I will not apologize for it. 
You can do it after 5.0, but it makes last four makes sense after 5.3. Maybe we'll go through all the posts. You took my Hilda, you monster. Um, maybe we will. I don't know where to play this. Maybe we'll wait until the post patches. Is what I was trying to say while cringing at my plays here. Oh, I'm so dumb. I forgot about Ultima Weapon. Ultima Weapon is so weak on the left side. Nothing I can do. Completely unavoidable. Nothing I can do. Completely unavoidable. Hilda from Heavensward. Well, glad to see that. She's a good card. Hilda, the card is so good. Triple Triad is from Final Fantasy... That's eight? Question mark? I'm so bad with Roman numerals. You guys know this. Don't bully me. Maybe it was card achievement. You have to manually collect your achievement rewards from the achievement menu. Oh. And you know one thing I want to change about my deck? I don't really like the Ultima weapon. Oh, I can't change it right now. I think the Shiva card is better than the Ultima weapon. Ultima has a nine, but like, it's kind of garbage otherwise. Do, 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 do. You piece. Of garbage. Hmm. Easy. We're back. Okay. <gasps> Lolorito! Lolorito Nanorito! Let's fucking go. I have received satisfaction. And then I always check the cards to see if they're even remotely usable. It's a two star, so it's probably not even remotely usable. Ugh. No, it's not. Four, three, three, seven. Ew. Lolorito, disgusting. Lolorito the Dorito. <laughs> if you don't know about achievements, you may have many things. Yeah. I didn't even think of that as you were saying it, Verd. Uh, where are they listed? Wait, these are all claimed. Do, 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 do. Paragon's crown? What the? <laughs> Character menu got you. Wait, what is that one? Another crown? What are all these little? I want crowns. Amaro horn. Dude, it's just full of little crowns. <sighs> I hope Teleji and Adeleji is on two different cards. Me too. Me too. Triple Triad was so popular though, they included it as a completely separate online playable game with Final Fantasy XI. Really? I understand it. I understand it. It's, it's definitely been an addiction. Anytime I'm doing anything, I see Triple Triad, I play it. It's just, I'm, I'm a simple man. I see Triple Triad, I play game. Titles are claimed automatically. Everything uh, that goes in inventory, you gotta collect. So I wouldn't even know where to begin to look. Maybe under dungeons would be something? Under trials, perhaps? Under raids, maybe? Oh. <gasps> A wind up Louis Swa. Oh, for uh, Quills of Bahamut that we're doing next week. Is there an easy way to see what's completed? Because otherwise I'm just going to be like mindlessly scrolling through. <laughs> oh! You're the best. You're the best, Rando. Thank you. Uh, sort by... Wait. Unfinished, completed achievements with mount rewards, minion rewards, gear rewards, miscellaneous item rewards. I think maybe we just filter by completed. 
I don't see a way to filter by unclaimed. I do not see. I do not see a way to do. Has he been emotionally devastated into oblivion yet? No, we're taking it pretty easy, Mac. In fact, we're gonna be doing a goofy quest line called the Hildebrand quests for like sort of an emotional detox. I love Old on Night theme. In terms of like comfort, Limsa Luminza day theme and Ulda night theme are just weirdly comforting for me. Limsa Luminza, because it sounds so, like the day theme in particular, it sounds so like hopeful. <gasps> Orchestron rolls. Orchestron rolls. Manderville weapons? What? There are Manderville weapons? Excuse me? You can click all but the first and last filter. Do, 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 do. And then this will do what I want it to do, right? Oh, not the last one, not the last one. I don't have a lot of things to claim. This is so sad. Yeah, I don't have a lot of things to claim. But good to know, because I didn't even know that this was a thing. Oh, <gasps> princely hatchling! Partisan's crown! Well, I gotta take the princely hatchling. Are you kidding? I'll leave that in there, because I don't want that cluttering up my inventory right now. But the little princely hatchling! Aiki, welcome back! How you doing? Don't ask yet. Okay, I won't ask. Forget that I asked. Phoenix down? Wait. What? What? It will instantly revive the person. Wait. Oh, cannot be used during battle. Okay, I was like, excuse me? How is this not hacking? I hear you've been a... Busy as a bee, sir. Seems half the whispers that what come my way relate to your comings and goings. Being the active type you are, I reckon you'd be interested in investigating some queer rumors, am I right? Queer rumors? Queer? Queer? You have my attention? You have my attention? Uh, but before that, let me ask. Ever heard of a man named Hildebrand? Uh, chat talks about him a lot. That's what I know. Boy, you don't mean to say you knew the bugger. I know he thought himself famous, but thinking it don't make it true. Shame that he had to go and get himself killed. All that nonsense about stopping Dalamud himself. What in the seven hells was he thinking? At least it was mercifully quick. Still, judging from the depth of the crater, he must have fallen uh, from an unfathomable height. Gods only know uh, what what was going through his mind as he watched the ground rush up to meet him. Oh god, I never want to be in that position ever. Never, ever, ever. Wait, the, the Manderville things are Endwalker relic weapons. Well, I know what I'm working towards now. Also, all the gear rewards from achievements will go in the armoire so they don't take room in your dresser. Oh, that's so good. So his father, Go Godbert, threw him at Dalamud back in 1.0. Got you. Amazing how well the body was preserved, though. Hells, it's amazing there was a body left to bury at all. Hmm. I had reason for bringing this up. Ah, right. So Nashu, Hildebrand's erstwhile assistant, has since become an inspector in her own right. At present, she's investigating the queer rumors I mentioned earlier. She's a sweet lass, a bit daft, but sweet nonetheless. So when I hear she's at wit's end, I want to help. Thing is, I prefer to meddle in the affairs of the living. Uh, zombies are the most definitely not my forte. So if you're willing, I'd be grateful if you lent her a hand. As for where to find her, she's likely to visit Hildebrand's grave in the Lichyard when she's frustrated. Try looking for her there. Is a secret. Is a secret. Notorious Monster Hunter is your title. Does that come from the Monster Hunter raids? From the Rathalos, or raids, trial? Rathalos trial? I wanna say it's a trial. I poke you. I poke you, sir. Oh, it's a 1.0 title. Monstrous. 
I love queer rumors. Same, same bestie. Monster Hunter title is available from Rathalos. Well, then I gotta do Rathalos. I love Monster Hunter. I still think it's absolutely wild that the two games collabed. Like, they're not even remotely similar games. Like, in how they're played, I should say. I think it's absolutely wild that they decided to collab like that. Nashu Ma Makaraka. Hello, Nashu Makaraka. Oh, if only you were still alive, Inspector. You'd know how to stop these zombies. Ah, you there. Could it be? You've come to offer your services to me. Nodders. Oh, but where are my manners? Allow me to introduce myself. <laughs> my name is Nashu, Agent of Inquiries, Extraordinary Inspector. At least, that's what I'm trying to be. It's not quite as easy as he made it look. Inspector Hildebrand was a great man, a real Eorzean hero. We traveled the world, me and him, solving cases and thwarting evil. No matter the mystery, you could always count on the inspector to solve it with grace and style. Hello, crotch shot. What's happening? Why, why have we given that view? But then there was the final case. The case of the century, he called it. How to stop the red moon from destroying the world. To save us all, he flew into the sun, and all I could do was watch. But then, then he came back down, and he, he... No way. We're getting an echo memory of it? Nashu, Nashu good bean? This is all a joke. A big funny joke, right, Inspector? Any moment now, you'll burst out of the ground and shout, Surprise! Had you fooled, eh? And we'll, we'll laugh and laugh. Hildebrand Manderville, beloved son. <laughs> they say, they say no one remembers the Warriors of Light. Their names, their faces, all gone forever. But I remember you, Inspector. No, gentleman hero Hildebrand. Terror in this outfit. Now it's time to seize the day. <laughs> hey, don't, don't, don't make fun of my little peasant boy. I love my peasant boy aesthetics on Lalafels. So cute. I can never be the hero you were. You were, but I'll do my best to try. I, Nashu, Inspector Extraordinaire, will carry on your legacy. That was a reference to the musical Newsies. I haven't seen it. So I told myself, well, Nashu, there must be a leader, a head zombie, who tells the rest what to do. Therefore, all we need to do is kill him. Uh, again, that is. Unfortunately, I don't know where he is or how to find him. But now that you're here, my faithful assistant, you can try one good idea I've come up with so far. If you go to where those dapper dapper zombies. <laughs> these dapper zombies were last seen in Southern Thanala. Are these gonna be zombies in tuxedos and shit? You might find them, and then you could um uh you could become their friend and ask to meet their leader. Yes, that's sure to work. I I I mm. Nashu, honey. Uh, I don't think it's gonna work. <laughs> I don't think that's how zombies work. I think they're just going to eat me. I don't think they're typically in the business of making friends. Wait, where was it again? Hello? Oh, literally right there. Oh! Hello world. Hello world, how you doing? Thank you for the pities. Not that I wasn't awake already, but I'm more awake. No, it is how it works? Okay, okay, okay. I've never heard that 
theme before. What's happening? Oh, dapper zombies. Oh, there's dapper zombies. A band of zombies has been exhibiting uncharacteristically civilized behavior of late, which has greatly unnerved the people of Thanalan. Dispatch the dapper undead for the benefit of the living. I feel so cultured. What did they say? They're just flexing. Oh, okay, no, they're actually fighting. I was like, wait, I feel bad? The fate may or may not be up. Got you. So did we get lucky then? Be gone, villain. Leave the gentle dead men in peace. I don't want to be killing you guys. I'm just doing the fate. I don't want this. A gentleman is rather than does. Lucky you, I had to wait for the fate. That's weird that a quest would require a fate. I think it's the first time I've seen that. How long will it take to get to your level? Um, a long time. Especially because I recommend you enjoying the story and taking your time and not rushing. It'll take a long time. But believe me, that's a good thing. You never did any uh, Realm Reborn Relic weapons, did you? No. I started doing Eureka for my Red Mage, because, hello, it's me, Red Mage main. Um, but I didn't finish Eureka, and I will go back and finish it eventually. Oh, it's like five minutes resetting? Gotcha. That's not bad. Genuinely non, this is a game that I recommend taking your time and enjoying because it's so worth it. Don't rush, explore all the things, and just fucking soak it up. Just soak it up. It's a good game. Your Lala looks cute in that outfit. Thank you. Thank you. I think somebody gifted me the chess piece, which has this cute little like plaid on it, this little plaid kilt. Not kilt, it's like a tied around jacket. It's cute. It's very cute. I love little peasant boy. Oh, wait, how do I angle my camera again? Here we go. I love little peasant boy aesthetic. Look how cute. There's a step in the Aroma Born relics that requires specific fate. Oh, Jolly was talking about this. That sounds bad. <laughs> that sounds painful. Unlocked first Shadowbringer raid. Now to wait for it to pop. You're doing great, Jolly. Ozma Mount is Eureka, but difficult, I hear. I saw somebody in a roulette for the first time wearing the uh, Eureka Relic armor, if it's Relic. I don't know. Eureka armor. And it was, like, glowy and cool and pretty, and I want it. But I think the armor is much harder to get. I farmed two of Realm Reborn Relics. Each took about three to four... You know, three to four days of farming is not that bad in the grand scheme of things. I come from Guild Wars 2, and getting legendaries in that game... Oh, boy. That is months of work. Months of work to get legendaries in that game. Doo -doo -doo. What are those? Hello? Hello? <laughs> teapots? <laughs> Hello, teapots? What the fuck? What a goofy weapon. This is Monk, right? Yeah, it has to be. Yeah, it is. Kettle Knuckles Nexus. They're relic teapots. Why? May I ask why? I guess because Goofy. The white mage, uh, Aroma Born Relic is so pretty. Is somebody, does anyone have it nearby me? Jad, I'm looking at you. I would like to see it. You won't be able to play with me? Sure you will, Non. Sure you will. You can always do roulettes together. Level 50 roulettes are quite common for like any stage of the game. Do, 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 do. 
What's your name? I think they are just now starting, Jolly. Like, I think they're still downloading the game. That's not a relic. That's not a white mage relic. I trusted you to have it, Jet. Only made the base, white mage got you. Not the full relic. And you can do leveling roulette. Yes, as of level 16, you can do roulettes with people. Because that's the first one, right? Let me double check them. Yeah, level 16 for your first roulette. And then the rest, like most of them are level 50. Did you find the zombies? You did? That's wonderful. I've been busy too. The head zombie will rue the day he meets me, you'll see. So tell me, what did you learn? We got a curious parchment. Writ upon this map of the Sigoli Desert is a flamboyant flowing hand are the words, a gentleman is rather than does. Oh, so you weren't able to make new friends. That's a shame. But this parchment, this is a map of the Sigoli Desert. There's a spot marked here in the south. And look, there's something written here. A gentleman is rather than does. That sort of reminds me of, um, well, no matter. Let's see where this map takes us, assistant. Onward to the Sigoli. <laughs> what is this flamboyant glam, Izagi? Come find me. I teleported away too soon. That was a very flamboyant glam with a top hat. Hello? And a mask? What is that hat? What is that hat there? Mirage hat. Oh, it's blue mage. Oh, too bad that's locked to only blue mage. What a cool fucking hat. Did all the quests in that cat village? Like all the, like the yellow ones as well? Oh my God, this person has the carriage. I saw this when I was looking at the Mog station and it's very expensive, but I thought it was so cute. How you have little people sitting in the back of your carriage. Look how cute you guys. Look, they're just sitting in there. It's so precious. Oh, I went at a weird angle. So cute. Not a glam? It's too bad it's not a glam, because I love that hat. I need my boy. I need my boy, Rathalos. I need you. I need you, Rathalos. Even though I hate fighting you in Monster Hunter. Ah, Rathian's worse, I would say. Rathian does the run. If you've ever played Monster Hunter, you probably know what I mean. We can farm a turret? We should. Hello, Prey! Welcome in! Prey, how is you? You could do relax with it? Yes, you could, is Lua. You'll also likely hate fighting it here, but yeah, we only have to do normal once and then EX spam. Okay. You'll need to fight him 50 times to get the mount? No way. And he also does the run. No, <laughs> that's so annoying. <laughs> I'm good, been super uh, cozy today on your weeb shit once more. What are we watching now, Prey? What are we watching now? I don't think I misread the map. Maybe they're just shy though. I say we call them out and let them know we come in peace. And when the leader shows himself, we strike. Either 50 times or get lucky. Oh, Rathos does not have AoE markers? I mean, that's in the spirit of Monster Hunter, right? That makes sense. I will go with the wild rose blooms. Oh, I should probably call out a gentleman is rather than does. Show yourself foul fiends now. A gentleman is rather than does. Erg. Erg. Who summons the gentle dead men? Why are they dapper zombies? <laughs> they live! They live! 
and we hunger. My brothers, lend me your ears. A gentleman does not dine upon his guests. <laughs> how are you? <laughs> That's not how physics works, sir. Spare this fine gentleman and fair lady your mastications. Withdraw, I say, and harass them no more. Up in the sky, look, it's a bird. No, it's an airship. No. It's the inspector! We hear and we obey. Sir, that is not how physics works. Physics are highly optional in his quest line. He doesn't look very zombie-y. It is you! It really is you! I knew nothing could kill the great inspector Hildebrand. Hildebrand? Who is this Hildebrand of whom you speak? My name is <laughs> My name is Zombiebrand, devourer of brains, undead overlord extraordinaire. What are you saying? You're not an undead overlord, you're a gentleman inspector. Er, er, inspector, overlord, inspector, overlord. Oh, Inspector, you just confused us all. Don't worry, I'll knock some sense back into that noggin of yours. S stay your hand, milady. You know not what you do. Uh <laughs> Even if I were the esteemed gentleman you purport me to be, the concussive force of the blast is more likely to liquefy my... If crashing into the ground made you forget, then an explosion of equal force ought to make you remember. I'll save you, Inspector, or kill you trying. See... Even you acknowledge the possibility this plan will result in my- Death. <laughs> what was that smile? <laughs> what? Hello, booty. Hello, booty shot. Okay. <laughs> Welcome to Hildebrand. <laughs> they tested a lot of animations in the Hildy quests, too. This is great. The entire quest line works on cartoon logic. Got you. Also, hi, Moon. Physics, he says. <laughs> Whoever that is, I love her. I love both of them. Normally, I would applaud your ingenuity, Nashu, but I would have preferred that you found a more elegant solution. Ah, he remembers! Inspector Hildebrand remembers me! Yes, yes, I remember you, my faithful assistant. What I do not quite remember is how I came to be here. Oh, more echo. Also, hi, Becky Bones! Hildy has always been used to play with animations. <laughs> I like the fact that he was like... <laughs> like, switched to a smile before getting exploded. It's Japanese slapstick. I don't have a basis of comparison. Got you. I, I get the feeling it's like how old school, like, comedy shows were a lot about, like, guy slip on banana peel, guy fall down, guy get hit in crotch, guy hit his head, that sort of thing. Um, and it's fine. I accept it. It'll make me giggle regardless because I'm five years old. Did he actually come out of the fucking- So is he a zombie or not? What is this? Very Dick Van Dyke? Yes, exactly. Oh, with the little flower on his head. Ah, such a wonderful dream. I slew a dragon and... What is this place? And for that matter, who am I? Was he just adopted by the zombie? Stop.
He lost his memory. <laughs> and they're like, yeah, you're a zombie, buddy. You came out of the grave. Welcome aboard. So he gets a concussion, goes comatose regularly. <laughs> I, Hildebrand, agent of inquiry, inspector extraordinaire, have awoken at last. I, I always knew you'd come back to us. Be it Red Moon or Black Dragon, no fiend is a match for my legendary might. And who might this fine gentleman be? Hmm, could he perhaps be one of my many admirers? But what is this faint tingling sensation in my arm? This ringing in my ears? This dizziness? Could it be... a case? Oh, he's got a clue. He's getting a clue right now. We should follow his clue. <laughs> How did you guys synchronize it? <laughs> Wait, how are you guys synchronized? <laughs> What the- also, what is this cute, cute, like, helmet you're wearing that has cat ear slots? Oh, man. Back in the saddle. Verily, it could be not else. Somewhere nearby, dastardly doings are afoot, and only I can thwart them. It's your Zex cosplay? I don't know who Zex is. Probably another Final Fantasy character. Copious quantities of sand. Unbearable heat. Aha! The Sigoli Desert. I'd bet my life on it. You loaded them after they started, so for you, they start at the same time. Got you. Oh, Gundam Wings X! Doing. Which means Ulda is but a short trek away. Yes, it all fits. Only that den of inquity. Inquity? Iniquity? Iniquity. Could so violently trigger my keen investigator's sense. Fear not, law abiding citizen. Inspector Hildebrand shall soon deliver you from evil. Looking very sexy, you might say. Hi, Ildaterra. Hi, Kyo. Question the residents of Ulda. Guys, I have to pee again. I don't like drinking water. I, I think I have a tiny bladder. I'll be right back. <laughs> I have to pee. Everybody go get water, okay? Stand up, stretch, do all your self-care while we BRB. He glitched out so bad. Oh, okay, we're fine. It's fine. She stepped on me! Step on me, Roxy! <laughs> it needs Annie's. Uh, I can faintly hear clicking from coming from the ceiling. I don't know what will happen now. If it is out and alive, then this is probably my last resort. The clicking is getting louder now. No, no, generic lab assistant! Guys! <gasps> I just scared my cat off my lap. That was a very genuine scream. Oh my God. With your legs bent slightly, squeeze. Bro, he did so much damage. It sat down to rest. Hang on, hang on, I'm gonna, I'm gonna sit down to rest. Ugh. Ugh. Guys, I'm Juzo, thank you for pets. Hang on, let me line up a better, a bit better. Oh, yeah. Ooh, ooh, pet me. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I'm sorry, that was gross. <laughs> Holy fuck. Nobody clip that, please. That was disgusting. <laughs> oh, God. You ever do something you immediately regret? Ooh. Okay, I'm back. Okay, we're questioning the residents. We're following Hildebrand's clue. He's got a clue, you guys. There's definitely a mystery afoot. Pray that emote. What even is that? Pepe phone? It's cursed. You're not who I'm questioning. You are. Agnes! Jolly, thanks for hydrate. He stole his cute mining helmet in Aroma Born. Had cat ears too. Aw, this is so precious. 
Love you too, Nan. Beg your pardon? You wish to question me as to the whereabouts of that deviant running about town dressed in rags? Do I look like a reporter for the Mithril Eye? I do not consort with perverts. <laughs> Be because he's running around in rags? Guys, is Hildebrand a pervert? So many blue quests. I've been slacking, Kyo. I've been slacking. Don't come for me. What? You're looking for a half-naked Highlander? What likes to catch criminals? I think I'd remember a thing like that. If you do manage to find this inspector friend of yours, I'll tell him to do something about that god's damn duelist. Me mate's pa's cousin's kid's best friend lost his blade the other day to that bastard. Me mate's cousin's pa's kid's... I can't. Comes after him. How dare you? How dare you bully me? We're working our way through them, Keo. Listen. Listen here. <gasps> triple try it. Hang on. I have to stop for a bout of triple try it. I will not apologize. I love Triple Triad. What do you got? Three open swap? Man. They're going to take my onion knight and I'm going to cry. What did they swap? Eh, not too bad. Love is a weak word. A better word is adore. <laughs> I adore you. How's that? How do I play this? They're gonna take, they're gonna take my card back. Oh, they didn't? The fool! In that case, I'm getting greedy. Nice, Sue. Oh, you fuck. Momodi Modi card. Who's Momodi Modi again? That name sounds so familiar. Oh, it's literally the. It's you. It's literally you. That's why it sounds familiar because I just saw your name. <laughs> it was a two star two star card, so it's probably garbage. Momodi. Oh yeah, you garbage. Yeah, you garbage. Not even remotely usable. Sloppy. <laughs> she is. Tara, listen. <laughs> listen, hear you. <laughs> hmm. Sorry, lad. But if it's information you want, you'd best you'd be best served by going to Wymond. The only rumors I've heard are those about the weapon thief. Calls himself a duelist or so, I hear. But when you don't allow your uh, your opponents to refuse, well, it's not much of a duel then, is it? Ah, you're in the outfit. You're in the outfit, chat. In the Nashu outfit. Can I dash to non-party members? Ah, that's no fun. Let me dash to random people in the wild, video game. I take it you've dealt with that zombie problem, eh? So do tell. Just why were they dressing up like dandies? Wymond! Hey, Wymond! Thal almighty bugger me with a bleeding spear! The dead have risen and they're walking the streets of Uldah! No need for melodrama, my good man. As you can see, reports of my death were greatly exaggerated. Is usable for the mode where the lower numbers beat higher numbers? I have a low deck and it's as many ones and twos as I could get. It's not perfect, but it's okay. What's the really reverse? It's I have a reverse deck. I also have a uh, ascension deck that's not great but usable. It's true he's not a zombie. I checked. I you do seem to be hale and healthy, which uh, begs the question: How in the seven hells did you survive that fall? Why question divine providence? What matters is that Eorzea's champion has returned, and that he uh, and I, by that I mean I, shall bring this thieving duelist to justice. Heard about that, did you? Might be harder than you think. Even if I've got no inkling of what that fellow's current whereabouts. Inconceivable! I refuse to believe that the ever-inquisitive, ever-ambitious, ever-reliable Wymond is without a single shred of information, even one of dubious re relevance. Mm, well, I make no promises, mind you, but there was some talk of a fair maiden, what said her most... 
The knave assaulted a young woman as well? The audacity! I should fly to her side at... <gasps> Why, if it isn't the gentleman from Sigoli? A serendipitous encounter indeed. Unless you too seek the belligerent duelist. Capital! It will be invigorating to engage in a friendly battle of wits. Already the spirit of competition fills me. Come, Nashu, we must away! I thought we were working together. Am I working against him? It's sad that the red mage villain can backflip without needing a target, but you can't. What a scam, Verd. What a scam. Let me backflip. Let me backflip with no target. Core or core, I understand needing a target because it literally flies at them. But let me backflip on a whim. Damn it, Hildy. I ain't told you the last's name yet. It's okay, you can tell me the name. Then play Dragoon. Can Dragoons backflip with nothing? Well, sir, you might as well go after him. He'll be disappointed if you don't. The lady in question is named Yellow Moon. She's a woman with a taste for the finer things in life. It's safe to say you'll find her getting fitted uh, for something in the Weaver's Guild most every day. Good luck with the inspecting, Inspector. Inspector Terra. Dragoon is literally all about jumping animations. Did somebody, did somebody say their animation locks aren't as bad as they used to be? Is Dragoon fun? Not like I'm not level leveling enough classes as is, but, um, is it fun? Are there any Dragoon mains in chat? <laughs> I need to start just looking at random people's adventure plates again. I still love mine. Dragoon is fun, but I bet it's subjective. I, I bet you it's like how I think Monk is fun, but a lot of people say it's their least favorite melee. They're considered the floor tank because they get animation locked. But they did shorten them. Okay, so they got a little bit of a buff then. It's my main class at the moment, I love it. Dragoon's your main melee, okay. Literally a mini Nidhogg? Kyo, that's so precious. And you do enjoy playing Dragoon. Okay, okay. Say less. Say less. Maybe I'll pick it up in my spare time. After I'm done leveling Monk, of course. My beloved pure heart was unlike any wand you've ever seen. Elegant, refined, the perfect accessory for any cultured woman. You'll bring it back to me, won't you? A priceless possession, callously ripped from the hands of its owner. The lady weeps and the wind bears her sorrow to his ears. What gentleman could hear this clarion call and not beg the honor of championing her cause? Ch uh, Dragoon is in line to get a rework at some point. Like Summoner God? That means it's going to get a massive overhaul. Does it cost to have multiple classes? Nope. You just need the inventory slots to support it. That's it. <laughs> if you want it tomorrow, you'll need to have all the classes. Damn right. I want it. They all need to be 80, right? And I have the road to 80 buff. What, what in the world? I swear to you, here and now, I, Hildebrand, agent of inquiry, inspector extraordinaire, shall scour all creation from the deepest pit of the seven hells to the very pinnacle of the heavens for your pure heart. What he said. And you, my fellow servant of justice, I see your instincts are not to be underestimated, having guided you to this fair maiden's side. Now then, Miss Moon, what can you tell us of the theft? Amaro also excludes the two Endwalker jobs. Oh, you mean the literally two that I picked up? Wait, Sage and, Sage and Reaper, they're Endwalker, right? Yeah, you mean the literal two that I picked up that Sloppy. I'm currently leveling? Inspector, you say, inspect these nuts, rude as hell. Thefts, sir. To be precise, my pure heart was only the most recent item to be taken from me. I, I'm i certain I had it when I left home the other day. After I browsed the latest fashions in the sun silk and took in a match at the Colosseum, I realized it was gone. So the time and the location of the theft are unknown. Essential details, without which we cannot solve the case. There is but one logical course of action, Miss Moon, to coax the hidden clues from your memories. We must reenact the Faithful Day's excursion. To Sunsilk sun silk Tapestries! None? You would like a forehead kiss, would you? Mwah. There you go. Here's your forehead kiss. 
do do bo bo do do bo bo do do From the deepest pits of the seven hells to the very pinnacle of the heavens, unleash Ultima is what La Habrea says. God damn it. He was quoting La Habrea, and I didn't even notice it. This not spooky, scam. Listen, listen, sweetling. I don't make the rules here. I just make the rules. Your game time keeps increasing. It was 30, then 35, now 40 days remaining. How are you doing that? How are you how are you doing that? Scam, listen. 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 Final Fantasy 14 fun. I like this game. Also, Sweetling, are you medicated? Hello? Call them out, Mac. Call them out. Miss Boone, would you be so kind as to describe your visit in detail on the day in question? Nothing unusual happened, but if you insist. I was pondering whether or not, or not to purchase a new dress when a man approached me and confessed his undying love. What sort of man says that to a complete stranger, I ask you? Naturally, I was taken aback. I dropped my purse in shock, not intentionally, on his foot, and he cried out in pain and fled. If I may be so bold, Miss Moon, that strikes me as a most unusual happening. In any case, it appears to be completely unrelated to the theft. Let us next proceed to the Colosseum and see what you remember. Now she's falling asleep. <laughs> he's cute cat boy. He's cute cat boy. Looks like he's straight out of a porno and I love it. Oh, they add game time when the servers get taken down. Oh, so you got hella lucky, Bell? You got hella lucky? And Recruiter Friend is accumulating? Wait! I don't think Recruiter Friend would do it. Wait. Does Recruiter Friend do anything like that? You did get medicated? Well done, Sweetling. Proud of you. Once again, Miss Moon, if you'd be so kind as to tell us what you remember. Well, like before, nothing unusual happened. Felt like gambling that day and was debating which match to observe when a gladiator approached me from behind and confessed his undying love. Naturally, I was taken aback. I whirled about and struck the man in the face with my purse, in shock, not intentionally. Unfortunately, since I was carrying a tremendous sum of money, my purse weighed about six score ponzes, and the blow was enough to render him unconscious. 120 ponzes? Miss Moon, you are a remarkably strong woman. Which is precisely why you were targeted. Oh, it's so obvious in hindsight. The thief bore you a grudge. No, it's more than that. He hated you with a passion. There sure are a lot of giant crates in Ulda. At the Weaver's Guild, at Sunset Silk Tapestries, and here too. Curious. Curiouser and curiouser. I am looking respectfully. I am looking respectfully. That's a nice dancer glam, genuinely. A pounds is a pound. Oh, so her purse weighed 120 pounds? Not a glam? Is this just dancer gear? Oh, is it dyed? Dyed dancer gear? These crates are everywhere, sir. I wonder what's inside. But I don't see how we can open... Oh, of course! I still have plenty of explosives here. Why don't we try? It'll be fun. Um, is this allowed? Uh, is this allowed? Funny enough, the director of this game forced his dev team to play WoW and take notes on what they like and don't like. And that's why I ended up so good. Literally just crafted gear from the previous patch. Damn, it looks good. Ah! Uh. Hello? Why were there people in there? At the heart of every crime rests a single, unassailable truth, reached only by navigating the web, a web of falsehoods and contradictions. Hearken to me now, for as a shepherd leads his flock, I shall guide you to my irrefutable conclusion. Metal Gear. <laughs> they took notes from Metal Gear for sure. 
a gladiator professes his feelings only to be rejected and physically assaulted in response, wounding, wounding, wounding his pride as a warrior and man, resenting his prow her prowess whilst recognizing his weakness, he carries out a more feasible vengeance. He robs Yellow Moon of her weapon, the pure heart. Inspector, we found the pure heart. The strange men sneaking around in town in wooden crates had it. It's not what you think. We're not thieves. We're devotees. Yellow Moon is our sun and our stars. We only wish to keep her safe from harm. And should she misplace an item from time to time, we'd collect it. For safekeeping, nothing untoward. You deviants were behind all the thefts all this time. You've been stalking me. What, what nerve? Ah, oh, such unbridled fury, such righteous indignation. We should be glad to accept the goddess's punishment. They want steppies. Goddess? Devotees? Ah, but of course, that I had you inspect those crates was a stroke of genius indeed. As I was elucidating but a moment ago, those fiends were obviously the ones responsible for the current rash of recent weapon thefts. Those thefts were carried out by a single individual, you imbecile. Lest you forget, you've forgotten, the culprit is a duelist. He only claims his victim's weapons after defeating them in single combat. If your powers of observation are as great as you claim, you should have deduced that uh, those buffoons in boxes were incapable of such. Twenty-seven percent user rating when it first launched. Oof. It 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 has gotten so far beyond that, Jad. Like when it first launched, disaster. Now, fire. Literally step on me, mommy. Literally. I should know. I'm a reporter for the Mithril Eye. My name is Ellie, and I've been investigating these incidents for weeks. Inspector Hildebrand, gentleman investigator and agent of inquiry. I presume? You're looking well for a dead man. It was stupid bad at 1.0. Mm. Would you like to meet one of the duelist victims? I'll introduce you with pleasure. You would be willing to share such precious information with me? Your generosity is commendable, Miss Ellie. May, I, uh, may this mark the beginning of a long and beautiful friendship. Have you seen the ending of FanFest for 14 2018? It's literally a tearjerker. Uh, no, the only thing that we've watched is Sokin playing Lahi. <laughs> yes, yes, very good. The name of the man is... Huh? W where in the bloody hells do you think you're going? I haven't told you anything yet. You can tell me. I'll listen. I'll listen. Can I read yours? It's all pixels. Is yours all pixels? Eh. Somebody boost me. Oh, it is pixels. Too bad. Playing the remake of Final Fantasy VII, a beautiful lady gave me a flower. I hope nothing bad happens to her. Crying internally, Kronako! Oh no! <laughs> Welcome back, by the way. Tara, why are you walking into that man's crotch? Listen, I was trying to read his paper. I was trying to read the flyer, but it's all pixels. It's not all pixels if you know how to read Eorzean. Hey, don't bully me. Filtered water is my quest reward. Why? Do I care about it? Ah, <sighs> I suppose since you're the imbecile's friend, uh, you intend to help him. The man you want to find is an adventurer named Humphrey. At present, he can be found at the Golden Bazaar. I <laughs> need to drink it in the desert, god damn it. <laughs> With luck, the good inspector may find his way there by the time you arrive. If not, then so be it. <laughs> I wonder what will happen when he discovers that the victim is a perpetrator as well. Oh no. Jolly, thank you for hydrate. Less than one week till my first tattoo. Eee, sweetling, let's go! I still really want to get that Outer Wilds tattoo that I posted in the Discord. I think it's like simple and it's beautiful and it's nerdy and it's awesome and I've never gotten a tattoo before but if I was going to tattoo something on my body it would be that. 
The video is, I'm referencing is 18 minutes long and was a big thing. Actually, the fan fest was during COVID, I think. Ah, oh, I'd be down to watch it, genuinely. You have four tattoos, Izagi, and we haven't seen them. Excuse you. You booked your holiday tattoo for February 9th. Let's go. That's right around the corner. Like, it's practically December. Is you guys' Christmas shopping done? Mine isn't. <laughs> I'm panicking. <laughs> I am Humphrey, and you are? At last, I've caught up with you. You there, young sir. I am told you are a victim of the marauding duelist. <laughs> you want me posting a bear back in the Discord? I mean... I mean... <laughs> me? A victim? <laughs> How amusing. You amuse me. True. I was challenged by the duelist not long ago, but where he thought to find a whelp... He found a warrior of light instead. I had defended my honor and my blade. See for yourself. You mean you won? That's amazing. I can't wait till I get a tattoo. Non, what are you going to get a tattoo of? Do you have any ideas yet? Cringe? Don't cringe at me, Kyo. <laughs> it's, from the same, it's from the same fan fest as the Automaton Lahi. Yeah, I would love to watch it. Oh, not you? You What, this boy? <laughs> well, it was nothing compared to what I faced at Cartano. Magitech to the right of us. Magitech to the left. Here I am, stuck in the middle with Master Lou. Uh, we were. Core. He was a dab hand with the old magic he was. I tried to save him, of course, but there's a limit to how many giant beasties a man can... I do wish 14 had daily recurring alarms. What? Wait. What do you mean, Bell? Like, wow, 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 What do you mean recurring alarms? <laughs> that man is no warrior of light. Oh, oh, I see what you mean. Like, alarms you could set. There's probably a plug on for that, Bell. Or, like, maybe, like, a, a desktop thing. You want it to go off every day at a certain time for something to in-game. I get you. I get you. I get you. Tell them, Elazar. Tell them how he lost and surrendered a sword that was not his own. <laughs> Your queue popped after 40 minutes and one of the tanks withdrew. Now you have to wait longer. Jolly no. Liar. Scoundrel. I trusted that bastard with me father's blade. Bid him take it to a smitty for restoration. Even gave him gill to pay for it. Then he comes crawling back, sniveling and begging for forgiveness after for losing in a duel. As if that's enough to set things right. Look at me, you bleeding horse, and look at me. Me flowing golden locks are no more. I've gone bald from the stress and heartbreak. I swear to everything holy that you'll face a reckoning if you don't bring her back to me. <laughs> all right, all right. He beat the shit out of me and took the old man's sword. I used the guild to pay the chirurgeon. I have no idea where he or the sword is. What am I supposed to do, huh? I can't give him what I don't have unless unless you help me find the sword. That's what you do, right? Help people? Have you no shame? First you claim a legacy not your own, then you beg others to help you with problems of your own making? You will refuse this man, won't you, Inspector? How are sad quests so far? Sad? Wait. What do you mean? What do you mean, Val? They're very sad. If, if you're asking me about like MSQ quests that I'm at, very sad is the answer. Very, very roller coastery and heart wrenching. <laughs> I thought you said last night all your MSQ was going to be sad. That's why I'm scared of it right now. What Final Fantasy is this? 14, Molly. And what of Elazar's flowing golden locks? How will forsaking young Humphrey help the man he was wronged? We shall begin our search for the sword by questioning the people of the Golden Bazaar. Oh, I'm doing Hildebrand. Yeah, I'm doing Hildebrand. This has just been goofy so far. Did you do Hildebrand yet, Val? What? 
Ooh, got <laughs> Yumi, I see someone move to Marduin. Yes, I did. And I got player housing. Hi, Yumi. When will I get to learn that emote? Is this an emote? Dude, this is going to be problematic. If they make this an emote that players can use, Limza is going to be a whole new meta. These knees, gone. We don't know her. This pose, all over Limza. There's a man nearby. Walk over to him. Okay, okay. Oh, it should. Good gods. <laughs> it isn't an emote. Uh, probably because of that. They knew it would be the new limbs of meta. Wait, who am I supposed to talk to? Jelly, show me. <gasps> you got games on your phone? Wait. Stay clear from them, too. Gave me the crotch rot. They <laughs> Here by your lonesome? Might be that we could fix that for a price. I didn't know that they were those kind. I didn't know that they were those kind of NPCs. <laughs> Isaki's panicking. <laughs> ARR was spicy. They're gonna give me the crotch rot. Run! <laughs> Jesus. Also requested pics posted. Eyes. Binoculars. Error spicy, Jesus, the crotch rod. <laughs> Lululo, precious. That boy should be ashamed of himself, robbing poor Elazar of a priceless family heirloom just to go show you you, uh, just goes to show you should never trust an adventurer who claims to be a warrior of light. Thieves and tricksters, a lot of them. Huh. It may not be the most honorable solution, but mayhap you should consider giving Elazar a counterfeit blade <laughs> if the deception brings him peace in his final days. Could it be so wrong? No, we've heard the term crotch rot. It's just funny that the game chose to use it. Elazar's sword wasn't much to look at, but at least it was authentic. More than a few collectors have been tricked into purchasing counterfeit relics. Do, 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 do. I like, uh, I like Izagi's muscle shirt meta. Binoculars. I like muscle shirt meta over here. Uh, by the way, Tara, did you went through the thermal water in Kugane? I don't think I have. There's like a hot spring inside Kugane? Antique swords? Oh, I haven't the foggiest about that. That traveling merchant, Jojompa, is the one you ought to speak with, assuming he hasn't left. Next to the inn? Okay, we'll make a, we'll make a swing by there. Is it spicy? Is it a spicy location? Chajampa! Trying a new game called Opus, story driven puzzle space travel game? Let me know the final review. Let me know the final review when you're done it. Opus. There are some sightseeings in Kugane. You know what I really want to do? The jumping puzzle. I really want to do the jumping puzzle in Kugane. Just to do it. I don't know if there's even anything you get from it, but I just want to do it to say I did it. It's one of the Ish Guardian Restoration shirts. The rest is crafted, other than the headband that was from recent summer event. Got it. <laughs> Imagine little Lala in a muscle shirt. That'd be so cute. There are a lot of jumping puzzles in Kugane. You might need an entire stream for it. Shut up. No way. Drink when we fall. Drink when we fall alert. I could go crack open a drink. I'm afraid I have no knowledge of an ancient sword. At least, not of one I can guarantee to be authentic. You see, anywhere as I determined to be of dubious origins, I immediately discarded in the spring east of Camp Drybone. Although, I have no swords for sale at present. I may have disposed uh, a facsimile similar in design to the one you describe. This presents a quandary. Though I am loath to deceive an honorable man like Elazar, a well-intentioned ruse may put his heart at ease, thus spurring the rejuvenation of his golden locks. Whilst we continue to search for the genuine article. <laughs> Trust me, Terra Lala's look amazing with that kind of shirt. It just seems like it would be so cute. The main tower gives you two sightseeing points. The inn has one. What are sightseeing points? Someone mentioned this to me about sightseeing points, but I don't know what that means. If you have the sightseeing log for Stormblood unlocked, when you get to the top of the jumping puzzle, you get a sightseeing entry for it. 
when you get all of them for an expansion, you can buy paintings for my house, do you me? Paintings? Hang on, this is this is very important. You know the vistas in Guild Wars 2? It's like that. I love vistas. All right, guys, guide me to the sightseeing log after this. Well, if there's a sword in that spring, it won't remain there for long. It's one of the more convenient sources of fresh water for the common folk in Camp Drybone. You should endeavor to be a more optimistic, Miss Ellie. Like me, I say we search the spring first before declaring all to be lost. Vistas, people arrive, right? Kagane puzzle first then? Absolutely. I will, on God, I will go get a bevy because I'm going out to like to have a few drinks anyways, like in my IRL event later. Um, so I will deadass go and get a bevy and we will drink every time I fall off the Kagane jumping puzzle. Or I will, no pressure to drink with me, of course. But that's, that's my plan. I'm gonna get sloshed before we end stream. You unlocked the log, but didn't want to decipher the stuff. Wait, aren't you just in a realm reborn? Ulger Ironheart in Brawlger's Reach, 1013. Bow, bow. Brawlger's Reach. 1013. Here-ish. Oh shit, how do you do it again? There we go. Okay, I have left the flag, so I don't forget. Oh dear, you really did start Hildy. I did, Valk, I did. <laughs> Welcome back. <laughs> you have to unlock, but don't have to finish all the previous expansions logs. Oh crap, so that means I have to do Rummerborn and he uh, Heavensward logs, or at least unlock them, right? <gasps> Speaking of logs, I think it's on my red mage. Oh no, I didn't complete anything else. I unlocked this thing. My friends were telling me about the wondrous tales. So now I have this thing as well. I don't fully get it yet, but I did some things, so that's cool. Hildy is love. Hildy is life. <laughs> Sparkling over here, Izagi. It occurs to me that I am not yet fully recovered from my accumulated injuries. It would not be prudent of me a prudent to immerse my body in the water, not without first coating it with a liberal ab application of salamander oil. That is, indeed, on many occasions my dearest mother tended my childhood scrapes just so. You understand the importance of physical rehabilitation, yes? Then you can assist me by pouring the oil all over my body. I can only reach your thighs, sir. I can only reach your thighs. Ah, this comforting scent, as though I'm a child in her arms. Quickly now, before it dries, knead the oil into my aching flesh. Why is this so sexual? Sir, why are you flexing for this? Oh my god. <laughs> Wondrous Tales will net you about half a level in experience if you fill it out and turn it in before it expires. And when do they expire? It's a to-do list. You can get some rewards if you do them. Gotcha. Once a week, it's nice weekly experience. When should I finish it by? Like, when's my turn in deadline? Apkalu Falls in Gridania is where a sightseeing log starts. Thank you. Things the Warrior of Light has to do. Tuesdays. Tuesdays, thank you. It says in the book. Okay. <gasps> Yumi! Hi, Yumi. What a precious little aura you are. Very dapper. Hello, hello. Hello, hello. It's good to see you. <laughs> Whoa! You're not on my friends list yet? Illegal. Illegal. There we go. Problem solved. Fixed. All right, we're uh. Gen I literally massaged his ass. Okay. All right. Ah, <laughs> uh, the rel. Gah! The pain multiplies tenfold. Gently now. Gently. I have to massage him again. Hang on. We gotta. We gotta keep with the ass theme. Here you go, buddy. <laughs> oh gods! Oh gods! Oh gods! Yes, at last, my muscles slacken and soften. The warmth spreads and the pain becomes pleasure. I have to keep... Massage Hildebrand yet again. While he doing squats. <laughs> what is this quest? <laughs> right there, yes, keep doing that. Just like that. Just like... Oh, yes! Now, once more, with feeling. Alright, hold up. All right, hold up. I'm too short. I'm too short. 
I'm doing the knees. I'm doing the knees instead. <laughs> I'm too short to reach a certain other area. That's actually your alt? Your main is a cat girl. Hang on, have we seen your cat girl yet? Ah, oh, never before have I re received such splendid ministrations. Now then, into the spring. You as well, my good man. Hello. Probably like 6.30. Yes, sir. Love you. Mwah. See you later. Spess is home and now he's leaving. <laughs> what was happening? Mac, don't question it. <laughs> I asked for it. <laughs> Hildy, you're making me uncomfortable. <laughs> I feel ucky. Don't. D just don't think about it. Just don't think about it, sweetling. Just don't think about it. It's, it's much better for you. Muddy pebble, holy pot. <laughs> also, welcome in, Alex. Oh. Izagi, what is that dance you're doing in the distance? What the fuck? It's so extra? How do I get it? How do I also do this? Dwarf tribe! Damn it. So I have multiple reasons to do dwarf tribe then. That's the lolly hop. It's so cute. Welcome to Hildy, everyone. A mix of comedy and uncomfy. <laughs> You've been productive! Excellent! May I see what you found? I found this one, and this, and this. You did Hildebrand's dad too? Phrasing? Phrasing bird? No sign of the sword Jajampa mentioned, I see. Ah! Now I'm all wet. What was that, anyway? Hmm? Something calls you to... This hole. Once again, my instincts have guided us to our quarry. That I had you search that section of the spring was a stroke of, of. Achoo! Inspector, it's bad for your health to conduct investigations in those clothes. I'll go to Ulda and fetch you some new ones. How thoughtful of you, Nashu. While you're there, purchase a few bottles of hair tonic for Elazar as well. The newest, most potent blend you can find. It's a sword. It's a scimitar. Is it not wonderful, my friend? Soon all of Elazar's woes will be no more. His sword will be back. His luscious golden locks. Everything will be good and nice and also cool. Hang on, hang on. I have to... Have to drive by hug the gamers. Have to drive by hug the gamers. Eh. Eh. Come here, you. Eh. Eh. <laughs> Had to do a drive by. Do 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 do. I love these streams, Tara. Always so energetic. Hey, thank you. It's coffee. My secret weapon is coffee. Maya! After a while, you stop questioning what's going on in Hildra. You just accept it. You're just like, I, I. It's just happening. It's just happening to me, and I'm. it's just all right. What have you say for yourself, Hildy? Oh, I can't even talk to you? What? Fine. Fine. As promised, I return to you your father's ancient blade. Aye, it is her. Every chip and scratch is just as I remember. Gods bless you, sir. I never expected you would go to such lengths for two strangers without a thought of a reward. Altruism is a rare trait these days. Tis common enough if you know where to look. A gentleman recognizes the good in every soul and understands that none deserve to be forsaken. It took me till Stormblood to reach acceptance. So wait, is there Hildy for every single X-Pack? And this is just Realm Reborn? Spoken like a true gentleman, though your garments beg to differ. 
Inspector, I've brought a change of clothing, and I also bought a supply of tonic from the peddler I met in Pearl Lane. Excellent work, Nashu. If you would just bring me that case. Aroma Born, Heavensward, Stormblood, and Endwalker. Weirdly, no Shadowbringers? <laughs> Inspector? Inspector Hildebrand? There appears to be something lodged in my forehead. Could it be a missive from an adoring admirer? <laughs> oh, they're adding new ones in Endwalker. Oh, adding new ones in Endwalker to Shadowbringers? Question mark? Or I guess maybe more in Endwalker. Astrologian DPS be like. <laughs> this is what actually happens when you receive like the spear or the ewer or any other <laughs> any of the other Astrologian cards. There's a huge chunk for Realm Reborn. Then there's Heavensward and S uh, Stormblood. Functionally skip Shadowbringers, only a footnote, got you. And then Endwalker, got it, got it, cool. Oh, they rushed Stormblood and were dissatisfied with it. So they took a break on Shadowbringers, fair enough. They want it to be good, right? I, I respect that. <laughs> there's a lot happening right now. <laughs> hmm. The author neglected to pen her name. I shall come to claim the collector's blade. Is that supposed to be flattering? No, you. It, it's supposed to be intimidating. The duelist wrote this. He's daring you to stop him. <laughs> A challenge for me. Oh, at last the curtain rises. <laughs> Very well, if I am to duel the duelist, I must address for the occasion. Dude, man's just bathing in this shit. Sloppy. It's... I, Hildebrand, agent of inquiry, inspector extraordinaire, accept your challenge. Moon, prism, power, make up. This is fantastic. They're going to skip Heavens or two, but fan demand prompted them to bring Hildy back in addition to the more serious spinoff they originally made. That's awesome, Ike. I'm glad. I'm glad we have a lot of this to look forward to. He's... he's incredible! So bold, so majestic, just like a warrior of light! No! A gentleman of light! <laughs> he is... exceptionally... something. Core Inspector Hildebrand! You look amazing! <laughs> Holy shit. Hildebrand. Fun fact, the difference in JP is Hikari no Senshin versus Hikari no Shinshi. Or, or Senshi, not Senshin. That's cute as fuck. I take it that you like Hildy. It's all right. It's okay. <laughs> it's, it's okay. It's an all right quest line. Over a full hour of queue, gonna have to travel to another DC. Yeah, for some of the more niche things, definitely just jump onto a packed uh, DC. This is far from the strongest of swords. Blue, blue skies and the rolling desert. How much longer must I seek the blade of legend? This warrior is giving old school Final Fantasy vibes. It probably is a reference. <sighs> Did 
do do. Challenge accepted, my worthy opponent. You shall not claim the blade. With my, let us call it what it is, genius, I shall bring you to justice. Wait, you wish to duel with weapons, not wits? This bridge hardly seems appropriate for such an epic battle. Hildeban will return in The Three Collectors. That literally looked like a trailer for anime. Oh, we're just here. Hey, I know that spear. That's the one I found buried with the pumpkins. Pumpkins sort of remind me of... Um, no, it's gone. Never mind. This is unhinged. <laughs> That literally was like an anime trailer for like the next episode. Or like an old school cartoon, I guess I would say. Tune in next time for Dragon Balls. <laughs> oh my god. Welcome to Hid Hildy. That was wild. This isn't Shadowbringers. This is the Hildebrand Adventures. We're taking an emotional detox break, Catherine. Don't come for me, okay? I need this. You have to let me have this. <laughs> the science of deduction. Hang on, this person, this lower half of this person's face makes them look like a babe. This white hair, it's white hair, okay? I'll be honest. White or silver hair on any character and I'm automatically simping. Emotional detox cringe, mental destroyed by video games based. <laughs> 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 well, I guess I'm cringe then. I guess I'm cringe. Perchance you are curious about the duelist's declared target. It so happens I have identified the weapon in question. The Treaty Blade is part of an Ishgardian noble's collection. Or was, I should say. No, it has not yet been stolen. It has been purchased by an Uldon collector, the wife of a wealthy merchant um, living in Vesper Bay. Based? Based on what, Ray? Right? Come on, you know what base means. Damn, you simp for almost all the scions? Uh, correct. Yes, C correct statement. Yes, I do. They all have white hair. I'm a simple man, okay? I see white hair. I see silver hair. I simp. It's just that simple. Me and the boys, when we go to schedule a therapy session, because we finished Endwalker and a chiropractor session after all the carrying we did in Pub Savage Raiding. <laughs> Taking care of your mental health? Poggers. I just want to quickly say that. Taking care of your mental well-being? Absolutely poggathy wogathy. Suffice it to say, I would be remiss in my duties as a reporter were I not to, uh, to investigate her. And should the duelist strike whilst I am present, well, I hope I needn't explain what a golden opportunity that would be. Ingratiating myself to her may prove the greatest challenge, though. I'm told she's a difficult woman to please. Fortunately, I'm also told that she has a fondness for rare flowers. The sort Tutusi in Camp Drybone sells. You come along if you'd like. Do these mounts ever go on sale, by the way? What the? It's a wind-up gentleman. Hello, wind-up gentleman. How you doing, buddy? Every so often they do, sometimes? Okay. The minute this shit goes on sale, I want you guys to spam me. I want you to spam me because I need loaf cat. I need the chonky loaf cat. I have a great need. A great powerful need. I imagine they would likely go on sale around Christmas. Maybe that's just wishful thinking. Um, what music do I want to listen to while we fly a very brief distance? <gasps> the Rose Ladder. Bum, 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 bum. Bum, 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 bum. I'm so jealous of that singer's rumbly ass voice, dude. Her. I can't even. Her. I can't even rumble my voice at all. <laughs> I cannot. I'm so jealous. Here you are, miss. Thank you for your patronage. Just finished Bioshock Infinite, by the way. It was interesting. Interesting is a good word for it. I really loved Infinite. Was it for love or money that you killed him? 
It was you? Have you gone mad? That was an Amalja arrow in his back. I don't even know how to shoot a bow. You don't shoot a bow. You shoot an arrow, sir. Terry, are you gay? My gator has been going off ever since I got here. Uh, queer. Uh, I prefer queer because sexuality is an ever-evolving thing and mine has been ever-evolving. <laughs> but my partner is male, so sort of, yeah. Sort of, you could say gay. Jad out here smashing the gaming backlog. Jad? I don't know how Jad has all this time to crush out all these amazing single-player games. I'm so jealous. Hi. I can kind of replicate that sound, but not with the lowest notes. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> I can't. It's hard. It hurts my voice. Hi, gay. Uh, I can kind of do that with my voice, but only when I'm quiet. Can't do it and raise my voice. Oh my god, I'm queer too. We're like siblings. Oh my god, bestie. We're like basically the same person. We love that for us. <laughs> Tara, I'm jealous of the singer. Also, Tara, Kermit the Frog here. <laughs> Erg. <laughs> Trans the dollar bean. Hello. Nice to officially meet you. I just make the time. I love story games. That's what I play the most of. I'll say it. I've said it once. I'll say it so many more times. My biggest love of streaming is the fact that I've been able to experience all these story games that I otherwise wouldn't have played. And it's fantastic. Spin a wheel, basically. And that's the game you play from your backlog. Damn. That's efficient. That's efficient. Amalja don't shoot fleeting, fleeing unarmed merchants. They capture and temper them. Not that you or your victim make for convincing merchants. If you're going to mis misrepresent yourself, put some effort into it. Wear gloves, for God's sakes. Or at least don't wear wave your hands in front of my face. The calluses on your fingers betray you as a veteran archer. Doubtless you used your skills to great effect five years ago, as did your partner. So again I ask, was it because he took from your share or your sister? You don't touch a man's kin. He knew that, and yet he... He... Damn, I thought he did it for the money. You too. He's all yours. Back from the void. Welcome back, Nan. <laughs> Hello, I am Kermit the Frog. <laughs> Ray, don't bully me. <laughs> Games that I'm working on. Hollow Knight. Hollow Knight's so good. Such a beautiful game. Y yes, of course. Thank you for the help, Inspector. At least he's competent. But when did investigating crimes become such a popular profession? It's not his job, you know. He just likes doing it. He belongs to one of Ishgard's high houses. Some say he's a baron. Not at all like that buffoon Hildebrand, don't you think? I try not to think about Hildebrand. We should get going. Lady Dur Durilda will not take kindly to wilted flowers. Hi. <laughs> I can't do it. My voice just cracked. Hi. I can't. I'm so jealous. What is the secret to getting good, deep voice? Is it just having more testosterone? What, what, what is the science behind somebody's tone of voice? Anyways, just need a voice changer. Ooh. Gonna go pee at your house. Please do not you me. It's not done. It's a work in progress. I'm so poor. <laughs> I'm so poor. <laughs> All I've done is the outside. Genetics with a bit of training. I guess vocal training is a real thing that you could probably do. All right, that's it. Smoke. <laughs> that would probably do it. A couple weeks ago, you beat all the Halo games. I had the pleasure slash mispleasure of, uh, oh yeah, you can't go in. I didn't make it open. Right, okay, good. I'm safe. I had the pleasure slash mispleasure of being dragged through um, all of the Halo games on the legendary difficulty with my friends. And it was awful and fun. It was bad and good. This dude becomes even hotter and better dressed during Heaven's Word. We haven't even seen him, Ray, but I'm already in love. <laughs> they can't get hotter. I lost my house and my partner and I broke up and trying to get my free company a medium house. No, Valk, that's so heartbreaking. You probably put a lot of work and effort into designing it too. You can visit mine when you need a break. It's very simplistic, but fun. I can't wait. I have a vision for my house. Either I'm gonna go for like a modern aesthetic or I'm gonna go for like cottage core. I really want to pull off cottage core, but I feel like that's going to be more expensive. You want design ho? Dude, I need to get you guys in like a, a, a Discord call and you guys help me design with... Uh, there's a app called Make Place that I've been using and that helped me somewhat design my outside of my house. I have a pretty deep female voice. I used to hate it, but I've learned to be okay with it. Perfect ara ara voice. Just saying. Just saying, Becky. 
You used to have a very high-pitched voice. Gosh, my dream house would be a Japanese-style house in the woods with modern con uh, conveniences. Conveniences, I think you meant to say. Depends on how the vocal cords grow in. The more you know. <laughs> Again? As I told you the last 20 who came before you, if you have come looking for work, you are too late. And even if I were in need of additional security, I would not deign to hire a common adventurer. Now remove yourself from my sight before I have you removed. But flowers. Some lavender. Did you really think I could be so easily manipulated? Present the right gift, speak the magic words, and you would earn my respect? What is more, a flower's beauty is fleeting. I value beauty which transcends the boundaries of time. Everlasting, enduring, unchanging, like mine. Now get out. Forgive us, Lady Dorilda. We meant no disrespect. We were afraid that you would not heed our warnings otherwise. A notorious, violent thief is plotting to steal the treaty blade. You fools. I shall come to claim the Collector's Blade, yes? I read the Mithril Eye. I know full well of whom you speak, and it is in none of your concern. I have a legion of guards at my disposal. Should he try, I will have him seized or worse. And even if by some miracle should uh, he should succeed, he will not escape my wrath, for I have retained the services of a certain gentleman. Also, Yumi, what do you, what do you, what do you think of my horrible outside design? Is it horrible or is it good? <laughs> Yumi, I need, I need your approval. Oh, American Sign Language. <gasps> That's so cute, Jat. Fully recommend that. It's fine. You're wearing too much. Okay, thank you. Okay, thank you. Getting that, getting that, um, that deck. I want to change the color of the deck, mind you. But getting that deck to float literally took me, I think, two hours. That was an ordeal. That was quite the ordeal. I have a slightly androgynous voice, but it's more feminine and I hate it. Gotta learn to love our voices. Do you know what color you wanted? I think I wanted some shade of gray to match the stone, but I don't remember which one was perfect. Ah, but you may see for yourself. Like every piece in my collection, he has been chosen with the utmost care. Now look on my peerless inspector, interlopers, and despair. Ships that pass in the night, a signal shown in the darkness. The lady cries out for a guardian, and a gentleman must oblige. I swear to you, here and now, I, Hildebrand, agent of inquiry, inspector extraordinaire, shall neither slumber nor sleep until the fiend who covets the treaty blade is brought to justice. Good sir, what brings you here? Are you come in pursuit of the duelist as well? Or perchance in pursuit of me. As if I would spend a single gill on an insufferable, incompetent... To be fair, you're not spending a single gill on me. Beautiful Ellison boy. Show me your face. The chance to investigate... <gasps> He's so handsome. The chance to investigate such an intriguing case is payment enough. Preemptive declarations of criminal intent are hardly in vogue. Both my characters are Omnicrafters. Your main is on Pentamelded, so she can craft most things. Oh shit, okay. Okay, I'm looking respectfully. Oh, you don't like getting misgendered every day? It fucking sucks, it's rough. His beard looks like the rebellion symbol in Star Wars. Verd, how could you? He needs an outfit upgrade, but he's a very beautiful boy. Sorry I'm late, busy solving a murder. Briardian, consulting inspector at your service, my lady. If Artoirel had Hoshifon's hair color and was a little older. Conniving inspector? Consulting inspector. <laughs> Rotting flesh and saltpeter. Hildebrand Manderville and Nashu Mak Maka Makaraka, I, I presume. Two rank amateurs playing at a profession of which they know not. Confusing inspection. Call me when you've finished with these wastrels. It's ARR outfits. Almost all of them need a bit of an upgrade. Yeah. 
Minfilia? <laughs> you see... I do not want nor need your help. Briar Odeon is more than capable of overseeing the transfer. Now get out, all of you. Where have you been, Maria? And where's my vase? There was this strange flying thing and I... The vase. I dropped it in the water. I was so... The vase? Which... Uh, the vase once belonged to the Royal House of Thorn. Do you have any idea how much it's worth? You will go back outside right now and search for my vase, and you are not to return until you find it. Do I make myself clear? My lady, pray allow me to go in the girl's stead. It is not safe, for she herself spoke of a ferocious wild beast. With my unmatched investigative skills, I shall swiftly locate and recover the missing vase, thereby earning your respect. At which point, you will gladly grant me permission to investigate the thieving duelist. Verily, it is a plan fiendishly clever in its intricacies. He's so much, Becky. Not when spoken aloud. Miss Maria, would you be so kind as to tell me exactly what happened? <laughs> He's way too expressive. It's fantastic. I picked up the vase in Ulda, like Mother said, and was on my way home. I was crossing the bridge when the flying thing came. I got scared, so I ran. When I stopped, it was gone, but so was the vase. I think I dropped it in Nafika's wells. I want to go and look, but there were scary things down there. I'm scared to go alone. You are no longer alone, Miss Maria. We shall go together and look for the vase. All five of us. All four of you. I'm going after Inspector Briardian. If the duelist strikes, I mean to be there. But, but Miss Ellie, how can you ignore the plight of a young girl for the sake of your story? Because that's my job, you imbecile. Well. We shall not be derelict in our duty to justice. Come, Nashu, we must away. You don't even know what the bloody vase looks like. Maria, dear, listen. If it gets dangerous, or if you feel afraid, you run to this adventurer for help, understand? Terry, you forget who he is. I love how, without fail, Every single time we start something, he takes off. Before we- <gasps> Hello? Hello? Hello, gamer? You get hug. You get hug, gamer. <laughs> Without fail, he runs off with no information. But yet always ends up at the same location. How does he do it? He's an- Oh, we're, we're close enough. He's an expert detective, you might say. Skill and enthusiasm, Tara. I guess it's all you need. Fair enough. Fair enough. I just want to see more of this Briardian character. Beautiful Elizabeth Boer. That girl what run by earlier, I, I seen her, had You're something in her hand. Star. 20 months feels like last week. It truly does, Nitro. Nitro! Thank you for the 20 months of Bezos bucks. Beautiful soul. Thank you. I appreciate you. I'm happy you're here. I forgot the quest log is funny too. That's why I was I was double checking it. How goes whatever you're doing? It goes great, Golso. It goes great. Good news! There's an entire side quest line about him. Be still my beaten heart. Be still my beaten heart, dude. Oh, I see now. Uh, had something in her hands, but dropped it while crossing the bridge. Didn't get a good look, but I reckon it don't matter any road. Whatever it was, it's long gone by now. Resting merchant? Very cute. Very cute little friend. What is this? <gasps> no way!
Hey, Yumi! You can't! Yumi! You sweet bean. I'm, you're like, which gray? I'm like, oh, I don't really know. You're like, have all of them. <laughs> Yumi! What the heck? Thank you. Also, my Chocobo saddlebag is my die. <laughs> it's my die space. All my dies go in there. <laughs> Yumi, thank you! Those are easy. Just bought off an NPC. Shit! Thank you. I have to finish ARR Hildy and then I can do it in Ishgard. Hell yeah. Hell yeah, hell yeah. How much does the, the Lofi cat cost? I think it's 24 USD right now, which is why I'm waiting for it to be on sale. Ah, the questline with Briardian Briar is the aforementioned more serious one. I'm still here for it. <laughs> Tara's struggle with saddlebag must be horrible, just covered in paint. Yeah. Bum, 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 bum. A vase? Well, anything that falls in the water is like to be swept downstream fairly quickly. Does this have anything to do with that queer winged beast I saw earlier? No, never mind. Briardian Quest, aka Ishgardian Martin Luther. I'm here for it. A pox upon that thieving demon bird. Wait, this is the flamboyant Olaf. You were the guy from the trailer. Uh, he shall rue the day he crossed paths with me. Ha, huh, a vase? I know not of what you... <gasps> Curse this infernal refuse underfoot. Every point is a dagger. There's something in the water at the man's feet. Let me get a good look at you. That says Oaf, not Olaf. Oh, shut the fuck up. <laughs> shut the front door. Shut the... Chim... Chimkin? The sickly Chimkin? The sickly Chimkin? Let me pet it. Hello, sickly Chimkin. I want sickly green Chimkin. Oh, not Count Olaf. Quiet, listen. Listen, all right? I'm not good at reading. I can't be doing the reading thing. Me ma never gave me books as a youngin. No, I'm just kidding. I just suck at reading. No! Not excuse you? Not excuse you? Thank you for the gifts. What the heck? The five gifted. That's 30 subs in the channel, Non. Relax. Thank you so much. I appreciate you. That should be enough money. Agreed. Non, thank you for all the support. It means a lot. As full-time streamer, it literally makes the difference. So thank you. Do I spy the treasured vase of Lady Derilda over? Oh, oh dear. Unge Duncan. Congrats on the gift sub, by the way. Um, does this belong to you, child? Forgive me. I was so engrossed in my search that I did not notice. Your search for what, pray tell? The demon bird that absconded with my weapon. I set it down for but a moment, only to see it next to the talons of that accursed creature. I gave chase, following it to these waters, and in my haste, I must have stepped upon your vase. Don't fret, Maria. I know it looks bad, but I'm sure Inspector Hildebrand will think of something. Oh, but I already have. My faithful assistant, hearken to me now, for as the rising sun doth dispel the darkness... So shall my solution resolve our dilemma. But first, we must gather as many fragments of the vase as we can. That should be enough money. You can buy the cat now. That's what you meant! Do not enable me like this, Nan. Do not enable me. Do not be an enabler. Good old flamboyant Olaf. What would we do without him? Oops. How could I have been so careless? No, I don't mean to talk to you. I want this one. 
stop, stop. Get out of my way, flamboyant oaf. Oh my god. Come to present your findings, have you? Splendid, let's have a look. Here you are. Well done, my friend. This should be more than sufficient for our needs. He has performed miracles with far less, after all. Manderville dance! Foggies. If Square hadn't nerfed gifting Mog Station items, it could be gifted directly. You can gift Mog Station items? You can give Mog Station items? Or was it, now you can't because it got nerfed? Question mark? There is but one person in all Eorzea capable of reconstructing this vase. A man whose skill with the hammer has brought rival goldsmiths low. So breathtaking are his works, so fearsome his competitive spirit. This man is no mere goldsmith. You speak, you speak, <laughs> you speak of him as one would of a great warrior. Sorry, I gifted you the... You did give me the clown suit. That's on the Mog Station. How did I not put two and two together? <laughs> how did I not put... How did I... Rando, thank you again for the clown suit. <laughs> I know I've said it like four times, but thank you. Oh, you have to have people on your friends lists. That's the nerf. Gotcha. Once, a notorious gang of thieves perpetuated or er, perpetrated a series of robberies in Ulda, targeting establishments which sold luxury goods. One such shop was owned by the humble lapidary of whom I speak. Some stuff is still limited, I think. Okay, got you. Why would they do that nerf? They get money either way. There's probably some sort of like scam that was going on with it, Becky, or something of the sort. His was the last shop that the thieves struck. For the following morning, they were found beaten, bound, and gagged in the gold uh, gold court. The brass blades never learned who was responsible. The only information they had was the testimony of a thief who kept muttering the words, The hammer. The hammer. He sounds dangerous. Aye, that he does. And I do so enjoy the company of dangerous men. Gilgamesh? What? Gilgamesh? Who is Gilgamesh in the Final Fantasy lore? I've heard this name a bajillion, a bajillion gorillion times. Greg, no, oh, that's Greg. Oh, good old Greg. Oh, sorry. It's Greg, my bad. I misspoke. I'm bad at reading. <laughs> Not if the credit card company takes their money back because of fraud claims. Websites you could buy codes for Mog Station stuff for cheaper, likely from stolen credit card info. That is why. Because shitty humans. Because shitty humans, Becky. That's why. The old way you could gift anything and it gave you a code for the redeem. Now they have to be on your friends list for 72 hours and only clothes and a few other things are giftable now because shitty people ruined everything. It's a recurring character like Sid. Thank you, Ike. That's why. But where are my manners? I have yet to properly introduce myself. I am Greg, and this is my companion, Enkidu. Well, not really. It has been many moons since I last saw her. So to ease the burden of loneliness, I tamed a rooster and painted it green. In any case, you mean to search for this goldsmith, yes? If so, it would be my pleasure to help. The pleasure is all mine, Gilligan. <laughs> I, Hildebrand. Gilligan. Hildy, come on, dude. Agent of Enquiry, Inspector Extraordinaire. Bid you welcome. If it is that hard for you to remember, I give, uh, I give you leave to call me Gil. Ex <laughs> Excellent suggestion, Greg. Playful monikers are an effective means of building camaraderie. Call me Hildy. Now then, from what I know of the goldsmith's propensity to procure his materials himself, I have deduced that he is most likely to be found in the vicinity of Blue Fog in the northern Thanalan. Uh, it is there we shall begin our search. Now I get why you guys said Greg. Now I get you. Very well, Gilligan. All right, Greg. Different from Sid, because all different... Those are all different SIDs, but Gilgamesh is always the same. You mean Greg, right, Bird? Just just getting, like, fact checked straight here. You do, in fact, mean Greg, right? I'm not sure who you're talking about otherwise. He's also in one of the Goldsluster minigames. Kafaker! That's why he looked so familiar. Okay, that design in particular. 
because you you punched the shit out of him in the gold saucer. Poor Greg. He never asked for this. A Dublin carcass? The Doblin's wounds indicated that it was felled with a hammer. A trail of bloody footprints leads to the north. I don't think it's been dead long. Maybe whoever did this is still around? Wait, where did the tattoos come from? Is it from the shirt, Izagi? <laughs> Izagi expresses his fervent <laughs> approval of you. It's from the shirt? Damn, that's cool as hell. Free tattoos on clothing? I'm jealous. Haha, <laughs> yeah, in the gold saucer, you punched the shit out of him. Yeah. Wait a minute. So I, going to bed, you get a lurky now. Now I appreciate you. Thanks for hanging out with us again. Hope you have a good sleep. Basilisk carcass. This goldsmith is not to be trifled with. The basilisk wound indicate that it was felled with a hammer. A trail of bloody footprints lead to the north. Single blow to the head. Impressive. Wait, what other quest do I have here? Oh, the ultimate ballad. Basilisk? On my hunting log? For monk, I guess? Yeah. Yeah, pugilist. Pugilist log, okay. Do you remember who else did that emote at you? I don't. I don't actually, Zuggy. The approval one? Do it again. Every N NPC in a 30 mile radius. I feel like that's a lot of their idle conversation animations. <laughs> Flower patales. Doblin, the Basilisk, this Ari man, all were slain with a hammer, as was that beast over yonder, unless I'm mistaken. Don't bully me with emotes. No, no one, nobody's allowed to approve of me anymore. If it's slash Hashavant, get out. That chimera must be his last, latest prize, which means he may still be about. Mayhap he's watching us at this very moment, attempting to ascertain our intentions. He was ever a cautious man when on the hunt. Alas, it comes to this. Though every fiber of my being cries out in rebellion, I must break my oath and do the unspeakable. What must you do that is so terrible? I must dance! I'm a Mander Mander Manderville man, doing only what a Manderville can. From the peaks of Curthus to Thanalan, Mander Mander Manderville man. What the fuck? Hildy, are you okay, bud? I... I cannot avert mine eyes. That is the dance of House Manderville, passed down from father to son. Were I to form it within his sight, within sight of our quarry, he would not be able to resist revealing himself. This dance has been passed down the Manderville family line for generations. Alas, I neglected to properly stretch my legs beforehand. My good man, I see no other solution. You must dance in my stead, though it must be a gross, nay, unconscionable violation of my family's traditions, I must bequeath to you the Manderville. I'm a Mander, Mander, Manderville man. He looked like he was doing the berries and cream, berries and cream. I'm a Manderville, Manderville lad who loves berries and cream. Up the octave. Berries and cream, berries and cream. He looks like a naked man. I'm excited. We are his siblings now. My constant comrade. For I have shared with you the secrets of House Manderville. Now you must use that knowledge, 
go to the Fallen Chimera and dance like only a Manderville can. How do I do it? How do I do it? I want to do it. I want to do the dance. Slash Manderville? No. How do I? Motherfucker. Why would it not just be Slash Manderville? Slash M dance. Slash M dance. I am precious. I am precious. I wish there was a way to intentionally sync your animation with another player. So cute, what the fuck? It's precious. It's cute in general, but I think it's especially something on a Lala. Berries and cream, berries and cream. I'm a little lad who loves berries and cream. Amazing. 10 out of 10. Would do the Manderville again. Slash M dance. That will now be logged into my memory for all eternity. Oh my. What the fuck are you? I don't like it. Can't unsee it now? You ruined it for me, Noble. What in the spirited way? Right? Oh, I think I'm supposed to actually interact with it. What was that noise it made? It's gone now. It made a horrific uh, when it died. Oh, the hammer is lodged in its head. Oh, in its heads, plural. What are you seeing, Kiddo? Fancy yourself a Manderville man? You would do what only a Manderville can? Then lift your legs and put up your hands. Be a Mander, Mander, Manderville man. <laughs> also, how great would the clown nose look in this scene? Ah, oh, it would have been perfect. Fuck. He comes. Three point landing, very cool. Also very naked. Ho ho ho! You have naught to fear from me. Not at all. The only accounts I came to settle were with the Chimera. <laughs> booty! Booty! <laughs> but you, Godbert is their name. But you were not drawn here by some coincidence, were you? No, you came in search of me, Godbert. Why else would, your, would you gyrate your hips in such a gentlemanly fashion, if not that? But more importantly, how in the hells did you learn the Manderville? If I did not teach you, then who? Oh my fucking god. <laughs> Why? <laughs> By the grace of Thal, what sorcery is this? He... He yet lives? Terry, you know this man. Didn't we meet him during the MSQ? Owner of the Manderville Gold Saucer. Right. Right, the Gold Saucer. Oh, he running for his life. <laughs> he took off after him. What an Adonis of a man! Look at him go! <laughs> Dude, Hildy is so expressive! Hildebrand Hiliador Maximilian Manderville! <laughs> Oh 
Oh man. <laughs> Ten years, Hildebrand. Ten years since you left home, and five since I learned of your trip to Dalamud. <laughs> Came back to stream, saw ass as thumbnail. Nice, let's fucking go, EJ. <laughs> He was clothes then. Yes, he looked like quite a respectable gentleman then. What happened to the cl to his clothes? That cutscene in Stormblood is literally the only time he's fully dressed in the whole game. Seriously? That's hilarious. Hello, granddaddy. Yeah, respectfully, we are observing. How long were you planning to allow, allow your mother and father to suffer under the illusion their beloved son was dead? Son? You were Hildy's father? Godbert the Goldsmith's a Mandeville man, smithing as only a Mandeville can. Oil him up and give him a tan, fit for a Mander Mandeville man. <laughs> Please, father, cease your undulations at once. There are more pressing matters at hand. His clothes are all fucking torn up again. <laughs> He's just like that. You know, fair enough. I'm not one to judge. And I did oil him up. Oh, didn't we though, Verge? Didn't we? Well, we didn't oil Godbert. We oiled Hildebrand. This antique vase must be made whole once more for the sake of Mistress Maria. Ha! Do not worry, little one. I deal with worse cases before my morning bowel movement. There's a quest you get to oil up Godbird too? Are we doing it? Okay, we doing it. Hold your applause until the end. Byrgot, guide my hammer. Look how it sparkles in the twilight, how it radiates elegance. Would you all not agree that it is a work of art? Be back in a bit looking up a guide for Savage. Good luck, Jolly. Good luck to you. Side quest in Camp Bronze Lake. Got you. I'll be spending some time attempting to require, acquire emotes? Reacquire. Got you. <laughs> At the spa where you oil him. Oh my fuck. You've completely destroyed a priceless antique's historical value. Nonsense! I've taken a dull, unremarkable vase and transformed it into something far superior. I hope you're paying attention, Hildy. How long has it been since you last held a hammer? Father, I... That is not my path. I'm an agent of inquiry, an inspector. It is my duty to help those in need. Miss Maria is one such person. There are others too, innocent people whose weapons were callously ripped from their hands by a thieving duelist. I thought you had put away such childish dreams. No matter, you will understand in due time. No, I will not. I'm an inspector, father. I give be naught else. Um, Mr. Godbert, sir, I don't think my mother's going to like what you did. She probably won't let Mr. Hildebrand help with the investigation. We cannot say that for certain, can we? Perhaps she will take a liking to this reimagining. Byrgot is pronounced Biergo? Byrgot. I'm hooked on phonics. I'm hooked on phonics and I won't apologize for it. <laughs> you spoke of a thieving duelist, did you not? It happens, uh, it so happens, I am something of a duelist myself. While we cross paths with this fellow, I would welcome the opportunity to pit my skills against his. And Kidu as well, I should think. I see you too possess a strong sense of justice. Full glad am I to have met you, Greg. Now, let us return to Vesper Bay and see how our vase is received. Vesper Bay, you say? What a coincidence. I shall be traveling there on business once I have finished gathering materials. Oh, I think I might... Uh, might have seen the demon bird which took my weapon. Go on without me. I shall follow and on.
Guys, I can feel it in my core. Nature is healing. Nature is healing. I don't feel like an emotional wreck. I'm not emotionally nervous playing the game right now. I'm not sweating profusely. I want to kill one more basilisk while we're here. For me hunting log. <gasps> is that little baby Grugamesh? Hello, Gilgamesh. Little baby. Little baby. <laughs> he looks so fucking angry. Back to Shadowbringers MSQ, you go, people happy. Nah, 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 not yet, not yet. I'm just saying, I can feel my heart healing. It's a nice change of tone, genuinely. I think that means you go back to the MSQ now, yeah? If I do anything else today, it's going to be healer role quests. It's good to take emotional health breaks. With how heavy the story has been for me, it's been damn near necessary. Greg Minion is from Achievement Vendor. But wait, I got distracted. I got distracted. This is not the right way to go. Here we go. Wait, do I still have my Vesper Bay tickets or did I destroy them? I have them. I'm so powerful. <laughs> I pronounce it the way Terra does, and it's the only way I've ever heard anyone pronounce it. Here's one thing you'll learn, Yumi. Rando is like the biggest Final Fantasy buff I've ever seen in terms of like lore and pronunciation and other Final Fantasy related trivia. It's crazy. I don't know how Rando has the has room in their brain for all of it. I hope she likes it. Bum, 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 bum. Mother, I brought you the vase. By the gods, have you all no shame? How dare you make my daughter complicit in your... Chicanery. Chicanery. The use of trickery to achieve a political, financial, or legal purpose. Chicanery. Chicanery. That is not how I would have pronounced that. I don't know where you found this gaudy trash, but it bears no resemblance whatsoever to the vase I purchased. Now see here, Lady Derilda, not only did you send Maria to fetch your priceless vase alone, placing her in considerable danger should bandits or wild beasts attack, which they did, but... Brain full of useless info. It's a, it's a skill. Gaudy trash. L Lord Manderville, sir, I did not realize you had arrived. I must away soon, but I must say one thing before I bid you adieu. Nice cuck. <laughs> nice cuck. None. Thank you for all the support today, you sweet soul. I appreciate you. I thought he had... I thought... I thought... I thought he had full clothing on. I was like, uh, hello. Clearly he's wearing full clothing. Full clothing. Oh. Though I know nothing... Uh, though I know it is nothing compared to the lavish accommodations an esteemed gentleman such as you yourself must enjoy, I pray my humble abode meets your satisfaction. He got them thighs, though. Crush a watermelon between those thighs. Oh, it does, my lady. It does indeed. Especially that exquisite vase over yonder. Although I gather from your previous comments that you do not like my reconstruction. Your reconstruction? Oh, I don't like it. I love it. I would go so far as to call it the new centerpiece of my Thorn Dynasty collection. I owe Rando an apology. Maya has informed me you are correct, good person. <laughs> ah, what a relief. I would have been most distressed had you said otherwise. We Mandervilles do so take pride in our work and never strive for professional perfection. Oh, but why am I repeating what my son Hildebrandt doubtless told you when he offered to investigate the duelist threats? Enough expository banter, I say. I cannot recall if your son used those precise words, but I do remember thinking that his help would be most welcome. You will be helping us, Inspector Hildebrandt, will you not? Wait a minute. Your father is Lord Godbert Manderville, the man who took Aeland's... Aeland... Aeolande? Quiveron's seat at the Syndicate? 
It appears there have been a many great developments over the past 10 years, of which I am completely unaware. In any case, we must re redirect our energies towards the investigation of the thieving duelist. Our first order of business will be to review all the facts with consenting Inspector Briardian. Briardian? Where? Where is best boy? Where is the handsome mains? I'm too small to hug you. Oh my god, I said hug in party chat. How embarrassing. Izagi and Jat saw it. They saw. I'm embarrassed. Look, I'll show you guys. <laughs> I said hug. I said hug instead of slap. Blech. Embarrassing. Found a V cute tuber who can sing. We'll update it get emotes. Good luck, EJ. I know a lot of the fake French in this game is crazy. That one grates my brain the most. The one that it's... I'm not even going to try, Rando. I don't remember how that's pronounced. R R no, I can't. Royal. No, that's definitely wrong. Why are you still here? Allow me to elucidate. Lady Dorilda has asked that we assist with the investigation. Now kindly share us, uh, share with us all your information. Fine. Our plans have advanced to a stage that you can't couldn't ruin them anyway. I commissioned several reproductions of the Treaty Blade through a merchant named Jajonpa, who traffics in counterfeit antiques. Nine more minutes till I can clock on go to space. Hike, you're almost there. You're literally there. You're literally there already. I would just pronounce that rule. It probably is rule. Only know some Cajun French. Some Cajun French? Yeah, but I'm not in space. But you're you're basically there. Nine minutes is blink, gone. These blades have delivered the obs uh these blades have been delivered to the observatorium, where they are being distributed amongst Lady Dorilda's cell swords. Once I give the order, they will transport them via alternate routes to Vesper Bay. Hi, Lyria! Welcome back! Oh, I think I get it. You're hiding the real transport with a bunch of decoys, right? They're all decoys. The moment the thief strikes, all our forces will converge on his location, including those disguised as small folk along each route. The real Treaty Blade will remain in the original owner's vault until the thief has been apprehended. Everything has been accounted for. You are superfluous. <laughs> what was that? He didn't even say anything. <laughs> oh my goodness, you're doing Hildebrand. Yes, I am. Yes, I am. We need an emotional detox from MSQ, so this was our answer. There was even a quest. Oh, it's why you. It's why you. It's in multiple voice cutscenes. And there was even a, a, a quest called The Reason Why You. Oh, I hate it. Oh, I hate it. Also, did someone actually get suplexed in the game? Yes, they did, Hike. Did you, did you see that, like, peripheral view while working? They literally got suplexed. <laughs> Mayhap we could use more small folk to watch the roads in and out of the observatorium. Uh, assuming you have the capacity to conduct yourselves in an unassuming fashion. Fear not, my fellow inspector, for I am the master of disguise. Have you any information regarding the duelist himself? A description? You never thought to ask Humphrey, did you? Uh, the thief is said to be a towering brute, dressed in red, who wields a halberd. Greg! <laughs> a man so garishly dressed should be easy to find in snowy Curthus. Then I suppose we don't need your help after all, do we? Come, or don't. I couldn't care less. Be seeing you. It's Greg. It's Greg. Can't handle his gentlemanly aura. <laughs> Pray forgive my lateness. Greg, my good man! What a pleasure to see you again. We just received new information regarding the weapon thief. A victim described him as a halberd-wielding brute dressed in... Dressed in... A ridiculous outfit! A ridiculous outfit? Ho, oh, now I am intrigued. What reasons would a warrior have for wearing impractical clothing? <laughs> what reasons indeed? It is enough to make a gentleman laugh. Greg got cake though, you right, sweetling. Them thighs? We got cake. <gasps> oh!
Yes, Yumi. Yes. Hello? Yes? The three collectors. Boop. You join under the stars. I'm in space. I'm in space. <laughs> Hike, you said about going to space? I am in space. <laughs> Your free company can now create its own unique company crest. To edit the company crest, you must first have authorization to do so. Company crest? Next, you must speak with an OIC, Officer of Arms, located in the, one of the three grand company of Eorzea headquarters. Once your company has attained the proper rank, you'll have the opportunity to apply the crest to pieces of armor. That's so cute. What? Company actions. Okay. Cool. That's so cute. Company crest. It's a few specific pieces that uh, that can have the crest. Not all armors, but it's neat. That's so cute. Kuiper's all excited, I just told her. <gasps> I love Kuiper. Kuiper's in this guild too, right? Or not guild, sorry, free company. Allow me to summarize our current plan of action. Our destination is the observatorium and our mission at... Izagi's dead. Izagi died. Izagi pulled a Thancred. Uh, observatorium and our mission is to pose as goodly small folk in accordance with Inspector Briarton's instructions. Naturally, should the situation demand improvisation, we are to disregard those instructions. Any questions? No. Then let us sally forth at, forth at once. No one will bite your head off for calling it a guild? Okay, thank you. It's my old toxic wow mentality. You're in a free company. I am, Val. And it's the same one that Kuiper's in. I played wow for years, same. When did you finally free yourself, Yumi? What was the expansion that you finally got free? For me, it was Mists. I do the same thing with Market Board and Auction House. My brain does it, but I do actually say Market Board almost all the time instead of Auction House. Dude, I love this glam for my monk. I think it's so cute. I also, I think I just like little hobo, little, little like, little peasant, sorry, little peasant aesthetics for my Lala. I don't know why I love them so much, but they bring me so much joy to look like a little peasant, little worker boy. You quit after Draenor. Damn, Orc Lords of Orknor, Rando? You stuck around for a while. You took a break mid mists went back in Warlords. Didn't pick up last one uh, with the Underworld. Um, uh, 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 BFA was the most recent one or was the one after that? <laughs> I get scared sitting in cutscenes. Tara keeps telling me to relax because no Vel? Ask the chat room. Gamers, if you see a little sprout and you're in a dungeon or a trial or uh, anything, do you ever get mad if a little sprout is watching their cutscene? Hi, Jacob. How you doing? Welcome in. I'm making people wait. Having wow brain is the reason I always say classes instead of jobs. I've just, yeah, I've given up on that moon. I will always say classes. Never. Watch your cutscenes. Never. I'm so happy. That's the experience. People are so happy to see a sprout watching their cutscenes. It's great. I get mad if they don't watch their cutscenes, right? Sometimes I see them skip and it's like, wait, have you been here before? And you're skipping because you didn't turn the setting on to auto skip? Or are you skipping because you don't care? And then that makes me sad. I love sprouts unconditionally. Their reactions are so great. Right, Ike? People who don't wait should be reported for being jerks. Yeah. I see frequently people say, like, if a DPS gets impatient and runs in, the healer's like, I'ma let you die, bish. I'ma let you die. You're disrespecting the little sprout. I remember telling every group I was in while leveling, hi, first time, because I was so nervous. Yeah, I've been telling Vel over and over, because, like, as streamer, it's been, I've been really blessed in that I've been able to group up mostly with chat when I do those kinds of dungeons, so you guys are like, you're there waiting, you don't give a fuck, right? Um, but even when I've done, like, random things outside of stream, They've still waited. Like, they've still been, like, chilling outside the boss room waiting for me. And it's just so good. And they're like, no, take your time. It's good. I've let TPS, DPS eat a tank buster for running in front of me on a few occasions. Exactly, Zuggy. That's how it's done. That's how it's done. Let me hug your leg. That's how it... Eh. Eh. That's how it's done. <laughs> oh, no, that position put your... Okay, all right. Anyways. Punk, thanks for the hydrate. Even after you lose your sprout, people are nice to first timers. Yes. I will say, dude, I'm just gonna straight up cry when they take my sprout away from me. 
It's why I never want to finish Shadowbringers, because I will not be, I, I won't be happy anymore. The minute I use, I use, the minute I lose this cute little green thing, my life is over. I was, was cued for Karn Hard alone and was so nervous to go in, but Zotras and Pimp rescued you. No, you're good. You're good, Val. They will wait 99.9% .9 of the time. They're very important. And it just like, even if it's not like a serious story cutscene, it's also world building. Like showing the intro cutscenes and showing the boss cutscenes. It's just, it's cool. It's nice. And no one will ever get mad at you for watching them. And I've told Val that a million times, so I'm glad like all of chat is backing me up on that statement. I swear we all have trauma from World of Warcraft. Trying to enjoy anything of the story, trying to go at any of a, like a relatively slow pace and getting rushed and p impatient people yelling at you. We're all hurt. Wow hurt us. When I ask who hurt you, the answer, wow. World of Warcraft. It was so traumatic losing my sprout to this day, I never wear my crown. <laughs> you have a crown too, Ike? I think when you lose sprout icon, you can work towards Burger King crown. I guess that's, that's a decent goal to work towards after. If someone ever doesn't wait, rarely, I speak up and let them know that it's courteous to wait. So I actually did that in a hard mode dungeon the other night, Lyria. Um, Cause I, I forgot we weren't in a full group. It was four of us. And I just thought we, all four of us were like together, cute, but we weren't. And somebody was watching a, a cutscene, and I pulled the boss and immediately I was like, oh my God, I'm so sorry. I didn't realize you were in cutscene. And I was like tempted to die. We just went slow until they were out of cutscene. Oh, look at FC chat. What? Hello? <laughs> Kyper! <laughs> Hi! I hear Sir Terrible has joined the free company. Welcome, my friend. If you don't know him, go meet him. Oh my god, you're not plugging me. Kyper, you're too sweet. Welcome to the free company also! My pleasure. I'm happy to be part of it. Okay, plug over. I love you, bye. Oh my god. How do I free company chat? Alt F, I think it is? Thank you! Yes! Hi! Hello! <laughs> Whoa, that was weird. I popped something up on my screen. Hey, thanks for the follow. <sighs> Just did a savage for the first tier of Shadowbringer raids. Sadly, didn't get them out. Jolly, never lucky. Never lucky you are. Which trial is this mount from? The music is so familiar. I'm scared to tell you because it's not one of the easy ones to grind. It's Bismarck. It's from Bismarck. I got really lucky. We were doing Bismarck uh, just to unlock it. And uh, it, uh, it dropped first time we did it. We were so relieved because Bismarck literally takes like 10 minutes just to get through. And it's because all the things have such like long phases to them where he's just in bone. It's not one of the easiest. It's the most time consuming easily because of the phases. A 90 can solo Bismarck pretty easily. It's just, yeah, it's not that it's hard. It's just so long. It's so long. But I actually really like the mount. I like the mount for two reasons. The music, because I like leaving mount BG, BGM on a majority of the time, unless I'm in Raktika, of course. Um, I like the bubbles and the music is really like, it, what kind of tone am I trying to say that this music has? It has very like explorative tones to it. Do you know what I mean? It feels like, fills you with a sense of like calm and mystery. I really like the theme. Golsif, what is that emote? Wojak group hug? We're gonna be using that for the emotional trauma ahead, okay? Wojak group hug? Will we buy the cat after stream? More than likely none, more than likely. More than likely. <laughs> Now that you've enabled me. <laughs> it's an accomplishment. You're only 10 levels over sync, so it's not easy. I had somebody, I had somebody help me do it. I had somebody help me. <laughs> Hail to thee, fellow servant of justice. I take it you are the one, uh, the many tasks with transporting a counterfeit treaty blade. Clearly you've mistaken me for someone else, sir. At ease, Sergeant. They're with us. More small folk. Keep an eye on them, or else. Was he gonna beat him? But, but sir, I... Ah, oh, bugger me. Don't you bloody move until I get back. 
I say, is this land always so inhospitable? The biting winds, the endless snows? Mayhap keeping active will keep help me to stay warm. Oh, and should I chance to find the thieving duelist, I will of course summon you. After administering the requisite beating, <laughs> Good, you're still- hmm? Wasn't there someone else with you a moment ago? Ah, you speak of Greg. He ventured outside the gates mere moments before your arrival, full eager to catch the thief, as are we. Come, Nashu. We, mu we too must answer the call of duty. Also, Val, can we have a can we have a shout out for Kuiper, please? I love Kuiper so much. You look like you might actually be useful. Why don't you have a word with my man near the east gates? We're undermanned over there. Update. I'm in love with VTube vibes. Sung twice? Wait, are they just like a just chatting streamer that's just singing, EJ? I have you to thank because it appeared in the Persona 5 streams in Discover. So because you were watching P5, you ended up getting uh, recommended them. You're welcome. Happy to deliver, EJ. Thank you for the shout out. Guys, press the heart. Kuiper is such good vibes. Such good vibes. Such good energy. So wholesome and nice and you will really, really like them. And you just started fighting things? Ah, you're a DPS anyways, it's fine. <laughs> Val, thank you so much. <laughs> you see that just now? No? Hmm. I don't think me eyes were playing tricks on me, but there's only one way to be sure. You wait here. We might get addicted to doing savage content. Let's go. Inspector, over there, look. What is it, Nashu? Pray tell me what you see. Aha! I see you, demon bird. You will not escape me this time. Why, hello there, my friends. Is that a miss? Oh, it's just Greg. For a moment, I thought you might have spotted our thief. Come, Nashu, we have lingered here over long. We must egress post haste. Whispers, thank you, no friends. <laughs> Hmm, there's not of the ordinary here either. No luck. Hmm? Now I really must away for work. Non, have a great day at work. Thank you for all the support today. I really appreciate you. We have scoured every ilm of this area to no avail. I can only conclude that, having learned that this opponent was to be legendary Inspector Hildebrand, the duelist renounced his criminal ways and retreated into hiding. Or perhaps he's waiting patiently outside the walls for more wagons to leave? That being said, should you decide to venture into the wilderness, you had best arm yourself with more than your wits. I appreciate your concern, Miss Ellie, but a gentleman should abstain from violence unless absolutely necessary. I'll fight for you, Inspector. I even found a weapon to use. By the Twelve, is that the self-same spear which propelled me to the Red Moon? Wherever did you find it? It was buried in the snow. Well, one cannot ignore the will of destiny. Return it to me, Nashu. Though I will still endeavor to avoid fisticuffs, I will be duly- Where did that- Where'd that chicken just go? The chicken went in the igloo for some reason. I will be duly armed should worse come to worst. Now then, we begin our search for the duelist to the east of the observatory. By the twelve! Greg? What are they doing? Hi, Sith! <laughs> The throw him up with snow is so cute. Hey! You can't throw snow back. What the heck? Surprise! <laughs> Sith, how are you? Guys, can, can we just look respectfully at Sith Elizabeth? So handsome. Such a handsome lad. Such a- <laughs> He's a he's a fun top. Such a handsome lad he is. Hi, Stellar. Welcome in. How you doing? <laughs> he's why you look like you're like reverse T-posing? Borpa respectfully. <laughs> oh god, Val! Not the Borpa liquor! <laughs> what sunglasses are these, by the way? These are incredible. I'm going to inspect you. I need really nice sunglasses. 
Shaded Spectacles. Shaded Spectacles. How do you get them? Borpo, respectfully. I also really love the, like, just, like, the formal aesthetic that you put your Elozen in. It's very... Looks like the really expensive Yoshi P ones. Oh, they're crafted. You can get them off the market board. I can't believe I have to waste all my money. No, no, I must focus on housing. I must focus on housing. I'm almost back up to a mill, so I can do a little bit of home decorating soon. I have decent enough glams, I don't need more. Definitely struggling to push buttons fast enough. Is Lua, what, what class are you playing again? Got mine off market board because I'm cheap and lazy. <laughs> do, 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 do. Let me throw at you. Eh. 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 All right, off we go. <laughs> I wish you could always throw a snowball, but uh, hey, somebody hit me as I was getting. I didn't even see Yumi there. Was that you, Yumi? I think it's cute uh, that it only th actually throws snow if you're standing on snow. But I wish it always threw snow. But I do think it's cute. I'm like 50-50 on how I feel about it. Arcanus, but at the same time, I do like controller for walking around. It's much easier on my brain for that. I think if you learn the controller controls, they're really good. We raided someone named Ponto the other night, and I'm pretty sure Ponto was using controller. And they were doing like really hard like progression content, which is crazy. And should just speak of the like the strength of controller controls. Ponto does use controller, yes, I thought so. So, it's a learning curve, yes, definitely. Hey, Andrew, with the Ponto emote. <laughs> Wherefore art thou, my nefarious nemesis? Recognize my mount. Give me one sec. <gasps> was it the, was it the two person? Because I think I saw it out of peripheral. The two person mech. My ultimate group has three players on controller. Definitely is good. Yes. It's definitely very well designed. Love the controller, but you're on PlayStation anyways. Yeah. Not like you had a choice, but it is good. Ponto uses controller. Is Ponto on PC or is Ponto on PlayStation? <laughs> Twas not the self-same creature, but one of many. Nevertheless, I know that my weapon is close by. Ponto is on PC, so specifically chooses to use controller, hey? That should definitely prove the strength of it. You play on PS5 as well, no choice but to use controller. You sense it too, don't you? <laughs> that was a well animated yawn, dude. Hildy? Oh man, I wish they applied more of these facial animations just in general around the game. Because Hildy is so expressive, it's kind of crazy. You actually can use mouse keyboard with PlayStation. Oh, that's cursed. I don't know if I like that. <laughs> I guess it has the USB slots for it, doesn't it? Oh, that's cursed. Always used keyboard mouse with this game, my brain cannot comprehend controller for it. I think it looks exceptionally well designed, but I think it would be such a learning curve for me at this point, given I'm level 80. <laughs> Can I share a Spotify and server? Absolutely, EJ. If it's got a banging playlist, share away. <sighs> Greg, I've been meaning to ask, why do you covet this weapon so? If you but beheld it, you would understand. In some ways, it bore resemblance to a spear, but in others... Other specs, it was quite different, almost like a halberd. It was covered with a magnificent axe blade, to which was welded a musket barrel. Ah, uh, it was one of the first weapons I added to my collection after arriving in these lands. Ah, uh, how I yearned to reclaim it, the strongest of spears. Huh. Huh. Inkiru! <laughs> Just in general, chat is fine, EJ, to post it. They kind of use it in one part of the MSQ, but it was hilarious. I want to say Emmett. Emmett's animations, I feel like, 
comes from the testing that they did with Hildy. Because Emmett is so expressive. He's so cute. Half the time he just looks so sad and he's just like... He's, oh, he's so precious. I love him. Couldn't control her this. Really stellar. Even after trying? Did you give it a fair go? Like, did you try it quite a bit? Oh, Asahi and Karasu. Got you. Everything about you. Even your face. It vexes me. That weapon of yours bears a striking... A striking resemblance to... To... The strongest of spears! I, I claimed this weapon five years ago. Surely you can't be serious. Now you call me Shirley. No matter. Give it to me. Give it to me! It's just really good vibe music. The spear and I have traveled together to the very heavens. I will not relinquish it again. The spear and I have bested many a man together. I will not relinquish it again. Then we are at an impasse. Dun dun. <laughs> I, I can't believe I'm saying this, but well done, Inspector. Thanks to you, we've caught the weapon thief in the act. M Miss Ellie, you are grossly misreading our dispute. Greg is a good, honest man, who I am certain has never stolen a weapon in his life. Indeed, I have not. Every weapon I have claimed was by rights mine. I love how silly this is. Same, Becky. This is such a good palate cleanser from everything we've been doing in the game. Fun fact, this gun halberd was the personal weapon of an Imperial Legatus from 1.0. Damn. Comic relief. Seriously stellar. I feel like a solid 60%, maybe, of ARR is how much 1.0 reference can we put in? Uh, each was a trophy for besting my opponents in single combat. I believe that constitutes a confession. Seize him. A confession to what? I have done not wrong. Bah, you are all beyond reason. Uh, yes, my plan to secure Greg's confession was utterly flawless, and, this, and his capture will be the coup de grace. The coup de grace. Just in 08S and didn't get the mount. Pain, Jolly. Eternal pain. Coup de grace. <laughs> Well, my plan is thus far flawless. Griffin Crossing is still impassable. I know who you are, even if that imbecile doesn't, so let's not mince words, once you have the skill to face the duelist in battle. Even so, your strength alone will likely not suffice. I suggest you muster allies who can? Wait, is this a... Is this going to be like a dungeon? <gasps> Maya! Hello. Eh. Eh. Hello, Maya. How you do? How oh, what's happening? Who is this? Shut up! You cannot! You cannot spoil me! You cannot! I mean, okay, I'll take it. Oh, you can't! You can't spoil me like this! Stop! Thank you so much. What the fuck? Thank you so much. I appreciate you. What the hell? Oh my god, yes. <sighs> We're gonna have such a little cool boy glam. Oh, what's happening to me? Oh, Google. We're gonna have such a cool boy glam! 
We doing this synced? Oh, hell yes, we are. Oh, hell yes, we are. Is this a trial? Is this a dungeon? What the hell is this? The moon lift dance. I thought it was the Manderville at first. <laughs> it's a trial. Let's go. Uh, well, let's go unlock it then. Trial, yeah. Let's do it synced if we can. Woo. Came by to say hi. Oh, hi. <laughs> Hildy, my man. Hildy. How did this happen, sir? You can help? Let's poke your ghost, teller. <laughs> Returning to Maduan right now. Okay, bet. <laughs> Nashu? Miss Ellie? Ah, my good man! It's a relief to hear your footfalls. As you have doubtless deduced, I was unable to prevent Greg from escaping through the doors. I must leave the rest to you. BGM 100? Bet. BGM 100 is unavailable at this time. You don't worry about what happens to Hildy. You just accept that it does. Greg! Back on Marwan, let's go. Let's go. Yes, it was I behind these doors the whole time. You took so long to arrive, I was getting worried you might have gotten lost. Long did I wonder your role in this play was a silent guardian, content to watch events unfold with minimal interaction. At the last, I understand. We were fated to duel, you and I. If you need anyone else, I can travel over. Okay, I don't know. Any, someone do a head count of how many people we have around right now. Best me and you shall have the spear. Fail, and your weapons are forfeit. Fair terms, do you not think? I will even extend them to your allies. Aye, I grant you leave to summon others. After all, it will avail you no advantage. <laughs> For Gilgamesh, it is in beginning time. Yo. Um. That's it. He got like 30% bigger. A sweet player just gave you the cutest little minion and you love it? Battle on the big br <laughs> Battle on the big bridge? <laughs> Not a very inventive name, huh? Not particularly inventive. Hello? Hi, Stellar. He's cute bun boy. Hello. You got the Nana Bear? Wait, so somebody, did somebody drive by gift you it? Boop. Boop. Did you get a drive by gift in Don? All right, uh, you come here. You come here. He's like, he's already in. All right, we have one, two, three. Four. I can't count. One, two, three, four, five. We need eight. Who's in for Battle on the Big Bridge? It was in Limines Limza Lominza. They were giving them out to Sprouts and new players. Wait, that's so cute. That's so precious. Which is Sophie and Scylla? Oh, it's Jat. Didn't Jat head off? I think Jat might have headed off. I can't remember. I think Jat headed off. We'll kick from party for now. So we need four more. Dude, that's so cute. Hello, Sprouts. Come claim your little minion. Oh. EJ, please listen to the mod's warnings, by the way. Give me just a second, I can come. Or you can unsync it. We could always unsync it. We got Jolly, that makes five. With Yumi, that would make six. Let's see who else we can rope into this. I know 
Vel, you don't have this unlocked, do you? Because this would, this is like your level of content. I don't think you do. Beckons to the Squirrel Emperor. Squirrel Emperor? Where's the Squirrel Emperor? <gasps> what is this? What is this little baby? Oh my god, it's a little Christmas squirrel! <gasps> it's so cute! Randall's log again, that makes seven. We need one more. Okay, I'm using raid gear right now on my healer. I need to give it a year and eight. Right here? I thought this was your dancer. Oh, that is your dancer. Ooh. I say yay. I say yay. I love, I'm like, I have such a weak spot for feathers in like anything. Like look at the monk weapons that I bought because I have such a weak spot for feathers. So for me, it's a yay. <laughs> he is on my shoulder in your screen. What, what a scam. Feathers? Yeah. The feathers that come off the Gruta weapons. Oh! Oh, oh, right, your your entire feather club. Izagi, you're like me. Do you also have a weak spot for feathers? With the Gruta weapon, no less. Oh my god, it's so precious. It's so cute and precious. Also feather headpiece. Oh, and bunnies can wear it. I'm so short. Hang on. How do I change my camera angle again? Eh. Hang on. Hang on. I'm having a struggle. Oh, maybe I can't from first person. I'm, I'm having a struggle. Is, very not Is it dyeable by any chance? Not that I dislike the white, but it would be even cooler if you could switch up the colors. Oh, mount to be higher. Oh, I could be really tall, actually. I'm so tall. I tower over you now. Is this what it's like to be a big person? I'm so powerful. Oh, hi, Yumi. Do, 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 do. Uh, whoop. So we have one, two, three, four. Wait, I can't count. One, two, three, four, five, six. Rando makes seven. One more human sacrifice we require to do the sync. Not that version. You need to run the Savage a few more times to get the Diable stuff. I mean, it still looks fantastic in white. So, not the end of the world. Right, 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 right. It was this feather themed glam contest. What position did you place in that, Izagi? Get in there to get murdered. I can tank if need be. I can also tank if need be. Yay! I can also <laughs> heal if need be. I can also DPS if need be. I can do all the things. I don't remember, but I didn't win. But did you have fun? Because that's all that truly matters. I can tell I'm becoming a proper Final Fantasy player because I have so many different roles available. <laughs> Jolly said, I may get you all killed. Sorry in advance. Yubi said ditto. <laughs> Instilling so much faith. Rando boop. Not me over here being 90, everything including Gathers Crafters. This weekend, if I have enough spare time in between editing, I'm going to uh, I'm going to pick up particularly mining and goldsmithing uh, before I try and bite on to being like a full-on Omni Crafter. Eventually, I hope to be an Omni Crafter, but I have the most interest in goldsmithing. Oh 
Who else can we rope in? We need to rope in one poor schmuck. We got our Derp Lander boy. Hello, Derp Lander. This is the other Manderville thing, right? I need it. Alas, I can't help tonight. D&D &D time. No problem, Mikey. Have fun. Oh, yeah. We could just ready up and grab a rando. Right. Right, right, right. Do, do. Um, Rumborn. No, not. Not Rumborn. Oh, high end trials, Rumble Born. No? What is it? What is it under? You already have one, Rando? I can't believe you. It's there? Am I blind? I need an adult. ARR, trials. ARR. I found it. <laughs> I found it. <laughs> I'm embarrassed. <laughs> Smiley face. <laughs> Away we go. <laughs> I did it too, don't worry. Okay, thank God. Oh, you paused over it twice. <laughs> Fuck, dude. <laughs> How embarrassing. <laughs> BGM 100. BGM 100. Unavailable at this time. BGM 100. Hey there, one random person. <laughs> Yo! BGM set to 100. Here we go. Where is our random person? Everly after, they're a sprout! We have little sprout baby! Banger alert, what the oh, fuck? Oh, it's Toad, your favorite! I'm Frog! I am become Frog! I think I was supposed to look away. Oh, ow! Hi, what is this? Is this good? It's just too much for me. Frog about them. Not my life. Everything. Not. Ha! I lied. <laughs> I've been This is far the strongest of I feel so betrayed. Goodness gracious. I uh, just remembered something. He left a ball. He's what, he's leaving? Greg! Greg, get your ass back here, boy. Paladin was covering me. Okay, any anytime I see a tether of any kind, it gives me anxiety. Coward mesh, yo. They take your damage. Oh. So you could kill a paladin if you tried hard enough. Stand at all the AoEs. What? Why so many chickens? I must say I Hey now! I'm paladin for static. <laughs> And if you're in a static, they more than likely throw you. These tornadoes don't look very friendly. No, 
I got frogged again. Rocket hunt! Ha! I lied. <laughs> He's so yappy in this trial, it's hilarious. Thank you for covering for me. I won't go down so easily. Everyone's running away. Why is everyone what's happening here? Why is everyone but me small? Am I okay? What did I do wrong? <laughs> Just execute somebody? Um well then. That's enough of a beating for now. <laughs> no way. <laughs> I love the part where he says, it's Gilgameshing time, and then just Gilgameshes all over everyone. <laughs> oh, man. Normally when from, you run from Chimkin. Oh, and he did, he executed the Sprout. Enjoy your seven comms, Everly. GG, Everly. This is the most comms that this pl this player is ever going to see in their life. That was great until the end there. I'm going to cheer for them real quick. No, don't leave. And then their chat, bo chat box explodes with commands. Ah, oh, Hildebrand is fucking dead. Why, Greg? Why? Alone yet still armed. Hmm. In it, yeah, who got the command? Which one of you guys got the command? Oh, it's Yumi. 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 That was my command. No. <laughs> Uh, in any case, he seems satisfied with the halberd. We will proceed with the delivery. Can that trial show up in roulettes? I will love to get that trial again, like in the future. That one was fun. Yes, it can. Oh, let's go. That's my favorite thing about unlocking all these extra things, is it's just more things to see in the roulette again. Very rarely. I guess it would require probably a sprout to be doing it. Or, like, sheer chance to end up with it. If nobody, like, is queuing for something in particular, and all of you are queuing for roulettes. Still, though, something to hold on to. Hi, Curlo! Thank you for pets! Dubilda! Less rare now, since Mandeville is needed for current relics. Oh, People are doing Hildy for Endwalker weapons. <laughs> I can't tell you how weird it is to get one of the ARR relic trials when you queue in a trial relic. You're like, oh, right, this trial. Ah, tis more magnificent than I had imagined. It will make a fine addition to my collection. What is that smile, Hildy? What is that smile, sir? Popped in to say hi before I go to my event. Curlo, I love you. I hope your day's fantastic. And with that, our business is concluded. Cheers. I genuinely mean that in your case, by the way. Husband? Are we married? Is that how it happens? They compliment you once and then you're married, right? I think so, I think so. All's well that ends well, right, Inspector? Though it's a shame that Greg turned out to be a thief. You're at the Mandarin part? Yes! 
Today we're doing emotional detox after this past week. For real, for real. I would have so many spouses. I'm married to half the cast, I hope you know. I think it was Yoshi P that said canonically, the players are allowed to self-insert themselves in any romantic relationship they want to, so I'm just I'm just I'm I'm a polygamist in this game, is what I'm saying. Hi there, wholesome Terra and lovely chat. Hello, Suvu. How you doing today? Gotta say now that I'm looking at it in the light, the glam is growing on me with the feathers. It's genuinely nice, Jolly. It looks like you're off to a ballroom. There you are, Inspector Bryden. Um, uh, why did you not wait for me at the docks? Hmm? Why are you all staring at me so? Oh, never mind. Where is my treaty blade? But didn't we just give you the treaty blade? Motherfuck. Motherfuck. What is this? Disguise yourself as the client and let the treaty blade come to you. Take advantage of an existing situation to distract us from the real crime. Brilliant. Tara, how far are you in Shadowbringers again? I forgot. We are probably, I would have to say, level 78 quests. My current quest is question marks, so I, I don't even have a name to tell you. But last we were on level 77. What, wait, what was the dungeon we just did, guys? Um, something well. Something well. Merrick's well. Maria's well. Something. I don't remember. Zelfatol. <laughs> I don't remember. <laughs> we're about at the same part as Shadowbringers. Let's go, Stellar. Level 87. 87? No, probably 78. Malika? Malika's well. Malika's well. That's the one. I was close. Wow, I'm actually surprised I was so close. I was shooting names in the dark, but I was starting with M. Look at me. How smart. Tara didn't answer me this time. Wait, 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 wait. Tara, Eiffel Tower with Inspector Daddy and Granddaddy, who's in front back. That'll emotionally detox you, <laughs> sweetling! I'll answer you in Discord. <laughs> People are gonna feel some kind of way if I answer you right now. <laughs> in general chat. I'll leave my answer in general chat after, okay? <laughs> it's not even Saturday. We can't have horny chat. <laughs> the one with the be not afraid light warden. The biblically accurate warden. What's that, lassie? The warrior of light fell in Malik as well. <laughs> Wait, is not, what day is it? It's Friday. Take advantage of, oh, I read that one already. It's 1 a.m. here, be naughty. It's technically Saturday for you. You're allowed to be horny. My in-game hubby is redacted. Someone I haven't met yet. Uh, my in-game hubby is um, um, Uriange. Um, Thancred now. Thancred finally grew on me and I understand why people love him. Um, 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 I don't even remember the art, Bert. Um, I don't even remember them till I see them. I have too many. Um, um, who else am I married to? Uh, Ishtola. Um, 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 Moonbrita. Um, 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 Hashifant. Um, <laughs> a lot. A lot. This entire game is just by panic, and it's fantastic. Uh, the man in red never spoke of the treaty blade, only the halberd. Moreover, he always issued his challenges in person. Dear gods, isn't it obvious? Oh yeah, Br Briardian is new addition to the, the, what do I call it? Menagerie? I don't, I don't think that's the right word. My, um, my, my uh, harem, <laughs> we'll call it. My brothel? I don't know. My collection of beloveds. Dear gods, isn't it obvious? What is it like in your funny little brains? It must be so boring. <laughs> Was he drooling? <laughs> If the man in red did not send the challenge, then who did? Oh no. 
Oh. I genuinely was not expecting that. <laughs> I have been hard simping for Emmett lately. Yes, true. Yes, true. I believe this is addressed to me. Condescending Inspector Briardian. Piss off. <laughs> 400 years have I slept. 1,000 faces do I wear. What is yours will be mine. I shall come to claim the Lapis Maiden's virtue. Ah, after 10,000 years, I'm free! When I first saw this dude, I thought the game was breaking because he was too expressive. Oh, Hildy, Curlo, I love it. I love it. I want to see more of this. The good old em Emmett simping. I can rely. Yep. Everyone simps for Emmett, especially after certain main story quests. I already loved him. I thought he was cute as heck in his gamer posture. Um, but I... Madly loved him after a certain a certain MSQ that we all know and love. The design and the wording are the same as before. The thief who stole the treaty blade sent this. Am I so wrong? Okay, wait, can I make an observation? These invites look like Phantom Thieves invites. Maybe it's just because I'm playing Persona 5 recently, but it looks just like Phantom Thief. Phantom Thief cards that they send out. What about Graha though? We haven't seen Graha in like 10 million years. Very well. I, and I alone, Hildebrand, agent of inquiry, inspector extraordinaire, once more accept your challenge. They're pretty much calling cards, right? They're conceptually the same. You want a challenge, huh? Stand and face me, you buffoon! I loved his face twitching. <laughs> Aren't they really about business cards in Japan? They're really about business. How dare you all laugh at a time like this, after allowing my precious treaty blade to be stolen. And you, Maria. Well, I suppose it's a little funny, isn't it? The two of them dashing to and fro, a pair of gentlemen mummers. <laughs> you know, it's been far too long since we've seen a show. We should head into the city later, just you and me. Ah. Wait, Derilda having a good mom moment? That's so sweet. Okay, bye, shower time, bye Curlo, have fun today. What do you think of Hildy now? That was really fun. That was really fun. They're not even business cards, they're name cards. Everyone has them. Not sure if it's still a thing, but it was. Was a big thing. Not bad, Hildy, not bad. You are indeed a Manderville man. Mark! Mark my face, O oh phantom of many faces! For it is I, the face of the... of the... Of the what? I didn't realize I was supposed to click. Elixir. It's still not good. It's still not useful. 1400 HP is nothing. Next time on The Adventures of Hildebrand, the fiend dares lays claim to the fair maiden's virtue as seeds of jealousy quicken within an inspector's soul. Can true love bloom on this battlefield? Will this Manderville man find his Manderville wife? Hildebrand will return in a case of indecency. <laughs> Dude, these quests are fantastic. Hey, what's with the goggles those men were wearing? They look special. Maybe if I ask nicely, they'll give me a pair? I guess we'll find out next time. Oh. He 
healing potions have like one very niche use, deep dungeon runs, and that's it. Goggles? <laughs> very good 10 out of 10. Those are incredible. Uh, I have to, oh shit. Wait. Oh my God, I didn't even realize the time. Guys, I have to end stream. <laughs> Guys, I have to end stream. Oh my God, I was supposed to leave at six. That's only 20 minutes ago, but fuck. Oh my God, I was, I was too engrossed. I wasn't even aware of the time. Fuck. Still, what a blast. Tara, I love you. Been lurking, but thank you for stream. My pleasure, Trini. Thanks for being here. Okay, streamer, bye-bye. Strum ending. I'm sorry, guys. I had to end early today. I know, four-hour stream. Short little baby stream. Before you run, forehead kiss. <gasps> there you go. Here's your forehead kiss. Thanks for letting me join. It was a pleasure having you. Guys, thanks for coming with me. Who? I'm getting distracted. Oh! <gasps> Stop being on beautiful mounts, you guys. That's such a cool mount, though. And the shibe. Guys, thanks for being here. Hey, -ya! hey. <laughs> Don't worry about that barding. Okay, I won't worry about it. It's very cool, though. It's very cool. Big blue burp and shiny lion. This game's great. I'm so glad we did the. I'm so glad we did the Manderville or Manderville, the Hind Hildebrand things today, um, because that was such a good palate cleanse. Oh, it's spoilery. Okay, we're paying no mind, but it is beautiful. It is magnificent. I love you, bitch. I love you too, Becky Bones. Uh, where should I send you guys? Do you guys feel like going? Who's on? Will you be back uh, for roulettes later? I can't make any promises. Um, I don't know when I'll be back, but maybe, Val. Maybe. Perhaps. 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 If you don't feel like waiting, you can go ahead and do them. Thanks for stream streamer. Thanks for coming, guys. Thanks for. <gasps> Guys, I think Kuiper just started their stream. Day two and Walker. Can I just ship you guys off to Kuiper? I'm just, can, I'm just gonna, we're going to Kuiper. We're literally going to Kuiper. Um, I don't even know if I can peek my head in, but Kuiper's day two and Walker. Um, so I can't join you. So wish them so much love. I absolutely love, love, love Kuiper's energy. You will love them as well. There you go, there you go. If you like my energy even remotely, you'll love Kuiper because Kuiper is very similar. Very similar vibes, very energetic, very sweet, very wholesome, just, just great person. Probably not just Raiden Run, yeah. I mean, I do have to Raiden Run anyways. So give Kuiper all my love. Explain that I'm running out to a dinner and I can't attend, but I mean, Kuiper knows that anyways. Um, and I love you guys so much. I love you guys so much, okay? Uh, I'll see you guys tomorrow where we're playing Persona 5 Royale. They in stream starting anyways, no spoilers. <gasps> okay, maybe I'll say a quick little hello then. Maybe I'll say a quick little. If they're in stream starting, hell yeah. Love you guys so much. Please be kind to Kuiper and please be kind to yourselves. Eat food, drink water, uh, do all the self-care stuff, take your meds if it's something you forgot to do. And we'll see you guys tomorrow for Persona 5 Real. okay? <laughs>